right. Today I'm playing X-Morph Defense. This is a tower defense PC game. I, I played one the other day uh, called Iron Guard, and I think that game was more suited for VR, apparently. Um, and I played the desktop version, which needs work. But uh, then people were like, don't play that game. Why are you not playing X-Morph Defense? And I had heard the name of this game, but I re didn't really know about it. Um, so I checked it out, and I'm like, oh my god, it's a tower defense game that I can play with a controller. And also, uh, I've been playing a little bit of it, and this one seems awesome so far. So um, I'm happy to have found this, and thanks to the people who uh, suggested it in my YouTube comments. Um, there are good YouTube commenters out there, and hi, good YouTube commenters. Thank you very much for existing. Um, <laughs> Data's Doink is here, Darth Gill is here, thank you very much, Corbin County Jr. for the sub, and, uh, Chaw Chi, thank you also for the sub. Hey, fuck you, hey, fu hey, that, you know what? Fuck you too. No, thank you very much for that sub, I appreciate it. Um, you're a good YouTube commenter. They're, they're out there. I know, I'm not trying to say they all, all, they're all bad, they're just, you know, they're, yeah, that's some, you know, whatever. Uh, Dick Cheese, right, we're gonna do that, okay. Retro Junkie 83 thank you very much uh, for the bits. Okay, you might um, like this game. Um, who is the old dude in the pick? Uh, oh, that's me. Um, you see the dark circles under the eyes? That's actually me. That's when I wake up from the stream. Or that's when I wake up from bed. And then, um, you know, and then I look in the mirror. And then, and then my, uh, my movie studio, you know, crew comes in. And they, and they put all the, the makeup on me, you know, to make me look 1% um, better. And then I get on stream. Yeah. Uh, can you talk about cock tonight? Y you can if you'd like. Um, I'm gonna play the game, but if you'd like to do that with somebody else, you know, enjoy. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna get this going. I did the first couple missions of this. Um, so, yo, know, wait, I gotta tell you guys what this game is. So, basically, we're the Borg, right? When you play this game, you, you play as basically like the Borg. Or an alien species that wants to come and take over Earth, right? You go from area to area of Earth and you try to take it over. So you're basically like kind of playing as the bad guy in this, which is fantastic. And that's something that I wish more games would do. So right there, concept-wise, I love it. I love that we're the aliens coming to take over Earth. Uh, so that's really cool. Um, but let's, uh, I, by the way, I only just started this. I did the, I did these first two missions. Uh, I just took out Canada, I guess. And now we're going to, I wonder if we get to do New Jersey. That'd be great. Um, <laughs> and then, uh, okay. So now I'm going to, uh, Great Britain. We're going to start that. Thank you. I am demon for the tier one sub. Have I ever have I ever seen a UFO? Yeah, oh, the one flew out of my ass earlier. Usually, that you know, when I go on break, they they fly out of my ass, and they are uh, they're unidentified. Did you identify them? So those are the ones I've seen. Uh, Toshi, uh, thank you very much for the tier one sub. He, he says, "LOL, geez." I don't know, man. Uh, like. I don't know. I, I like I like uh, I like Star Trek. <laughs> I like the Twilight Zone. Um, I don't. Um, I don't know. Uh, you know what? The, the, I have I have totally seen them. I've seen them in this game right here. They're they're all over the place. In fact, it's me and I control the ships. Aliens are invading Great Britain. See? After the first encounter in South this is Africa, this is the UFO right here, the and uh, I'm flying it, and I'm going to take over. 
Let's send I'm going to take over the world. Where they came from. So, okay. I'm dispatching a quick assault recon to the castle before we prepare the main assault force. The guy that's talking is, um, like the Earth General. Uh, this right here is your, like, main base that you got to protect. In the bottom right is the little mini map that shows the direction of the waves that's coming in. So like for over here, and, and it's nice because it shows like the, the path that they're coming or whatever. So what you can do basically is you want to make the path longer to get there and you really only want one path for them to get there so you only have to like worry about one thing. So I'm gonna try to block off the sides here. So what I'm gonna do is, they're probably gonna all come out of, let's see, let's see exactly. So they're gonna come out of here. Can I get them to merge together somehow? Maybe I can't even do that. Um, oh gee, I guess I can't on that one. Really, I don't go over a bridge or something? Huh. Okay, it looks like that, that one, I guess I can't get to merge into it. Like, I wanted to get that over here, but I... Oh, wow. Are they all separate streets, actually, that I can't get this to happen? Maybe... Okay, there's a bridge here. Okay, wait, wait, wait. So I need these guys... Okay, so here's what I want to do. So so you go into this mode, which your ship is, like, whatever. It's, like, build mode, or you're, like, in, in, invisible or whatever. So what I want to do is I want to block this off so they can't like get here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put like, I'm gonna put this here. This might not be the best place to do this, but eh, I don't wanna put it there. But let's put it like, actually let's put it here and let's put it here. These are, these are my turrets basically. And what I'm gonna do, you're gonna say, is I'm going to, oh, I can't make a fence between those, crap. Uh, can I put it? What if I put it here? What if I put it over here? It still doesn't connect it. Crap. Hang on a second. I think, actually, doesn't it make a line if it's going to connect it? Give me a second. I'll, I'll figure this out. Um, where can I put this? I guess I'm going to have to put it there. Here. I, I'm going to do this. I didn't really want to stick it there, but I'm going to do there and there, and then, then I'm going to build the fence in between. All right, now, see that, I changed the course, and now now they're all going that way. So that's one thing I wanted to do. But the other thing is that there's this, and I really, unless this bridge, like, gets destroyed or something and then merges into that, but I don't know. So it seems like there's not much I can do to turn them, I guess. What if I put a, what if I put one in anyway and just see what happens? Um... Here, let's, uh, sorry, I'm trying to figure this one out. What if I put it here and here? I wonder what it would happen. They'll probably just go around the damn thing. I bet. Oh, yeah, see, he said it was blocked. So that's the only way for that to go. All right, I don't, I guess there isn't a way for me to do that. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm just going to put down um, some turrets that'll attack them in the meantime, basically. The bottom left is uh, the, I don't know what to call it, like the currency basically, the little, the yellow basically. So for every block of the yellow, I can build another turret down. Um, I don't even know what the bottom right one is yet. Um, I just started playing this, so I'm like learning. Um, so I'm gonna put one more up here. And then I guess I, I could probably even do more than that, but I kinda wanna save them. Oh, yeah, and then these guys are going to be coming out from here, right? So let's put a turret there. And let's put... I'm going to put one here. And then I can build one more. I'm going to build the other one. So remember, these guys are all, like, merging together here. So I really... I should have... I should have one here for sure. Um, okay, so, I mean... Eh. We'll see, we'll see how this goes. This might not be the best start, but put a toilet down. Well, yeah, what if they, uh, there was a, we could do that. They got a tower defense game based on shit. Sleepy Garrett, thank you very much for the tier one sub. Damn no CRT. Dried income. 
I have a CRT right here. I did the Atari stream the other day, and um, yeah, no, just blow gigantic loads all over it the whole time. The whole time. That's what I do off stream. So no, it's over there. It's just that right now we're playing this PC game, but the 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 CRT dried and come. It's sitting. It's sitting right there. Yeah, so don't worry. I got I got you covered. Wilson, Kurt, Jack, thank you very much for the sub. Appreciate that. Thanks for the 7800 stream. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm glad that I finally was able to do that. Um, at this point, like, I, I, you know what? Where's that book? I have a really cool book that shows consoles and shit. I should, I'll, maybe I'll grab that later and we'll go through it. I'll, I'll break up the stream a little bit later. Somebody remind me of that. But uh, right now, I want to do. I want to do a wave. Um, but I want to go through the book and then uh, it lists like every console and then we can see what I've done a stream of and what I haven't. I like to do a stream of like every pretty much every console. Maybe not every like Pong console because like that kind of gets like. But like every like major console, I'd like to eventually do. Anyway, all right. So I'm gonna start this. Light ground forces on site. Commencing attack. Ten parties in the zone. Attacking. All right. So here they come. So, okay, here's the other yeah, fighters come in. Light ground recon team moving towards alien base. Over. So these ships are like basically just coming to attack me. And w once one of my, I don't know what to call it. Um, I'm gonna call it money because I don't know what else to call. It. In the bottom left there, once it goes yellow and I get another slot, um, I'll put it down. I'll try to put down another turret because I clearly I need one. So you can do that till you have like a stronger attack, which is really good. The um, the attacking is really like satisfying in this. Okay, so then over here. All right, so that's like wave one. Assault helicopters entering the zone. We'll give them hell. <laughs> the aliens are morphing their towers. They built some kind of AA defense that's ripping us to shreds. Humans are preparing multiple air unit formations for an airstrike. We recommend setting up anti-air defense towers. Alright, I need anti-air defense that towers. These extraterrestrials can morph their structures to suit their purpose. I'm designating the aliens, codename Xmorph. Oh, uh, there's the title of the game. Um, alright, so... Yo, they're gonna try to... I haven't seen this yet, so... Okay, they're gonna be flying in from here to attack my base, right? So basically somewhere along this, I have to build uh, an anti-air thing, huh? But, which is like, oh god, what have I played? There's like another tower defense with like anti-air. Here, hang on a second. And then can I change this? Oh, there, there you go. That's probably the anti-air thing right there, I would imagine, right? Is that that? So it's gonna shoot them down, I suppose. Oh, you know what? I bet it's uh, fucking. What was that other uh, tower defense game I played? Um, defense, defense grid. I bet probably has the like the anti air. Um, probably a bunch of a bunch of things anti air or like uh, does fucking uh, what's the name of that uh, game that came out on Switch um, and like DS and all that? Uh, fuck. I can't think of it. Whatever. Anyway, there's anti-air in other games is the point. All right, I put that down. Okay, so I have three more that I can put down. Um, I'm going to put another one here. And let's make that anti-air as well. Oh, like Warcraft 3. Yeah, like the... So Warcraft 3, I didn't even realize um, that I guess that that technically has... Like that's like the first tower defense or par part of the game is, I, and I didn't even know that um, because I 
just, I was like a Warcraft 2 guy, Tides of Darkness, and I just like, that's like one of my favorites ever. So I just would always just, when, basically when Warcraft 3 came out and then World of Warcraft, I was just still, I was just always on Warcraft 2. I just never moved to the other ones. I was just like, I'm good with Warcraft 2. I didn't like need more than that. So I never really, I did play Warcraft 3, but I was just like, I wanted to just play Warcraft 2. So I didn't see all of that. Um, Oh shit, wait, hang on a second. There's gonna be another anti-aircraft thing going on over here, I didn't realize. Okay, so we need to, okay, it's gonna, they're gonna fly over this. So, yo, um, here, let's have one here. Oh, I can't make it an anti-aircraft? Oh, I don't have the money left to do it. Shit. Well, fuck. I guess I'll, that'll be the, my first order of business. We're gonna see how this goes. This might be bad. Shit. Your at the alien I mean, I could have sold something. The Air support, your location, one minute. I'll see. I'll see if I can take these guys out myself. Oh, am I not able to take them out? Wait a second. Also, these other turrets are like, are, are helping a bit, sort of. And you can, like your main craft, you can um, switch to all sorts of other, uh, all sorts of other stuff. Man, I'm gonna get fucked up here. Bad, bad news, huh? Oh, I'm fucked. Also, like, uh, fuck. Oh, man. Okay, this is the regular thing. I gotta, okay, I gotta get better at switching between all these different modes. So they're attacking my main base. I've been mostly sticking with the uh, the original gun, and that's oh boy, that's not good apparently. Dude, they're fucking me up. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh, we're fucking dead, huh? Oh god. Oh, they took the shield down or something. Fuck. I haven't had this happen before yet. Fuck me. I have, a, I have a bad setup. Jet Parker's ETA, three seconds. What is this jet? Oh, the fucking, they're coming after me with that. Okay, here's this jet fighters. Fuck them. Damn it. I bought like a protective shield thing for the base, but who knows how long that'll last. Probably not very long. It's just so you know, I, I just like started this. I'm having a lot of fun with this game though. It's really fucking cool so far. So like, I wish I would just have the chance to just like practice for a second. Because you can like switch between. So this one is. Reports that the metal covering the ground is a highly advanced method of gathering resources and producing energy. So you can like switch your ship into different modes. Oh God, this is coming. I'm sending out bombers to deal with this. Oh my God. They can just take my turrets out. Oh shit. Oh no. Powers destroyed. They literally just do that. Or is that just showing what they can do? 
we're sending more bombers against their primary structure. All alien towers along the flight path are targets of opportunity. Humans are trying to destroy our towers, but the assimilation technology allows us to easily reclaim and rebuild them. However, try not to build defense towers directly under enemy bomber flight paths. You might not have enough time to rebuild them during combat. Okay, so I gotta like I gotta take these out first of all. There's like a lot that needs to happen then. So let's take this out. Let's take out any that are like right under it. Actually, so basically I made I guess I made a mistake here putting them there. And then this guy's gonna come here. So these these ones are all right though. I think it's just the the bomber ones are a problem. So I'm gonna. I am gonna make that anti-air, but so this guy, if I have it like further away, maybe they won't do it. So let's say this shit's coming out of here. This is all, this is all new to me, so I'm just like figuring this out as I go. So what if I had this shit like over here, a little bit further away, and then we do anti-air on that shit, and then maybe it'll fuck them up. And then we'll do another one, like... I want it to be within range so that I can actually get them. Let's have one here. And do another anti-air. Look at all those things on that tree that I can unlock. This game's crazy. And then it's gonna come along this path. And then what about, like, yo... I want it to be able to take out shit over here, too. So I'm gonna put one, like, over here. I'm just making guesses here as to what will work. I don't really know. So hopefully that takes out those bombers. Mm, I, I don't know. Um, one thing that can't really hurt too much is to have some shit around my base, you know? So like, if I have like one, I have some like regular ones like over here so they can't fucking get in. Can't really hurt, right? It'll just protect me. Or protect my base. And then this, these guys are coming in. I mean, they all have to go on that path. So, like, so many guys are going to be over there. I should have one here. I should have more than one. I'm going to put two here. I'm going to put one here. And I can put one up here. I don't want this bomber to hit him. I'm going to put it, like, here. I'll put it here. No, I'll put it here. I'll put it here. Okay, there we go. There, there's all my. I put down a lot that time, so we'll see if I can get through this. Also, thank you, uh, Retro RM, for the sub. Sorry, I will. I'll talk to you guys. Uh, I guess I should do that now before I jump back into the next thing. Is this the version on PC? I got the, this is on Steam. Yeah, it's PC version. Uh, Cal X, thanks for the bits. Appreciate it. Mike's poops look like. The uh, Pringles can. That's yeah, yeah, that's true. Exactly. I just so yeah. My log la launcher shoots out like a hundred Pringle can shits like a minute. <laughs> yeah, that's how it goes. Can I borrow your toilet? Uh, what do you not have one? Mine's made of solid gold, so um, I don't know if you like that type of toilet, so I don't know if you'd want to borrow it, but that's what I prefer. Sammy Sheehole, thank you very much for the tier one sub, and uh, Sphincter, thanks for paying for the sub from Finger, then, uh, and also uh, gifted a sub to uh, Jay Dread. appreciate that. Thank you very much. How many bits do we need to donate to get a go on your toilet? So to come over and take a, a shit on the toilet? Oh, um, a billion, one billion, one billion, and then I will ha I will contact you. One billion bits. Hey man, it's a golden toilet. All right, let's start this. This is the next wave. All right, so they're coming out from, let's see what this, this shit's like. Is it gonna be bad? Also, so I can hold this down and I can do that. 
Oh, I fucking got him. I'm trying to just take these bombers out immediately. Oh, they're just gonna keep coming. I thought there was only gonna be like two of them. There's gonna be a lot of them, huh? Let's go down here and take care of whatever's going on here. We'll Alright, so you know what? I'm gonna put down another turret right here because everybody's coming in this direction. So, yeah, by the way, so you can build in the middle of battle. It's just, I, I try to do most of that when I'm not in the middle of battle. Alright, let's get over here. I feel like this is doing fairly well. Uh oh, wait, these guys are getting close. Hang on. So I need an another turret over here. I'm gonna drop one down in a second if I can. Let's do that now. Here. And, yo, there's more coming this way, so I'll put down. You do not want them getting to your base, that's the idea. Fuck. And then I also have. I, oh shit. Yeah, 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 shut up. Okay, so this is the bomb mode, I think. I haven't really messed with this much, so let's try this. Yeah, so you can also do bombs. You gotta, like, wait a while? I don't really. Air support ready. Got your back. Sorry, I'm trying to fig figure these other modes out. And we can switch to, yeah, like right there. I don't know if you have to, if there's like a cooldown on that or what. Okay, I'm gonna try it again, let's see. See, it's like, you, you, I think you can't just do it again immediately. Detecting enemy transports approaching from southwest. They are planning to drop ground units close to our base. Oh my god. We will block their path with a laser fence to close this route and to create a base. The bait will have to go through. Use this strategy as often as possible. So they're opening up a new route uh, to the south. You know what's one thing I like? I like that the the person who's my voice is like he sounds like a transformer. It's like Unicron or something. You know how I am with um, like voiceover stuff. I, it's a, you know what though? It's like it's telling everything that they're telling you in this though. It's very like this is like what you need to do. Oh shit! Am I going? Fuck! Hang on. I thought, I thought it was the next round. Hang on a second. So, like, um, it's like tutorial stuff. I'm, I'm only in the tutorial of this game, just like learning how to play it. I didn't even, I feel like I didn't even, I mean, this is the story mode, so I guess it's the real thing, but I feel like I'm still just in tutorial. I'm like learning how to do things still. Um, but anyway, the main guy that's talking to you, I think it's cool how he sounds like a Transformer. It's like you're talking to Optimus Prime or something like that. It's not just some, 
fucking like a lot of these games just have like these really boring generic like people. So I, I like the character. I like and I like that that's us. We're not like the human general. Like we're we're basically the fucking transformers. We're we're Decepticons. We're, it's like a, a cross between Decepticons and the Borg coming to like take over Earth. So I like that about it. And I like that so far the information that you have to listen to is like it's about the gameplay. It's not some bullshit like story thing that I don't fucking care about. If you're gonna talk to me, it better be about things about the fucking game, and that this seems to be like that. So that's like really well done. It's all very like you have to put down these turrets in this manner. You have to build a fence like this. You like the has failed. You know. We'll be sending transport helicopters in the next wave. See, they that guy's telling me directly in the what's going to happen in the wave. They're going to send out helicopters. Transports can be ground units. They can fly past some of our defenses. Okay. So anyway, so okay, they already put. I guess that was automatic. They put that down. So I got to really see what's happening here. So they're going to... What is this? They they fly out. Oh, they're... They're, like, warping in from that spot. And then they're coming around. Oh, I didn't know they could do that. That's interesting. So the, so the enemies, I think, are starting. That's a start spot. And then we blocked it off. Because usually, usually what I've seen in this game is they come from off screen, but this is, uh, that, that's like a, I don't know, like a warp zone or something like that. So they're coming around here and they're going to go up and they're going to merge with this. So what I need is more, um, I think I need more, you know, turrets here. I can't make a fence because they ha they have to be able to get in there. You can't just like block them off with fences from every. The, the game doesn't like let you do that, and it wouldn't make any sense. Um, oh no, that's where the planes are like flying to. I don't really know. Or no, you know what that is? I I, I know what it is. It's not a warp. It's it's those planes are coming in, and that's where they're dropping the ground enemies that are that are coming. That's what that is. So if I was able to. Yeah, well, like, what about right here? If I put it like an air thing, I wonder if I could like take out those planes before they even drop the fucking guys off. Maybe I don't know. That's just like a guess. Um, and I can only put down like one more thing. I better. Oh, there's just too much going on. Um, man. And they, they're all coming from here, so I don't know. Um. It, it doesn't hurt to have as many of these here as possible because it's near the base. So I'll just put one there. I don't know. That's as much as I can think to do at the moment. There's a, there is a lot going on here. So, um, also, so they're coming from the side here. They're coming out here and they're dropping guys there, which are going to come down and merge here and come to the base. Oh, you know what I should do? I should really probably block this off so that they come over here and merge together is actually what I should probably be doing, you know? Um, or at least put two here so they have to go around this shit to get there. Huh. But I don't really want to take these turrets out either. I might do that eventually. Because you want their like path to be longer. I mean, that's one thing I could do, but I don't, I don't have anything to spend at the moment. So I guess I'm just going to go. Dan Evil Robot, thank you very much for the Tier 1 sub. This game looks interesting. How is it going so far? It's cool. The icon on the right side of the screen when you drop the bomb shows your cooldown. Okay. I don't know which icon. It, like, what about the, um, in the bottom right, the, I don't know what the bottom right shit is. I know over here is, like, how much you're purchasing. I don't even know what that is. I don't, I know the mini-map. I mean, under the mini-map. Um, anyway, I'm going to do this next thing. But, yeah, if you've played this game and you have any tips, you definitely let me know because I'm just starting out. 
throw bananas at them. Oh, that's that's a good method. Why don't I throw bananas at them? <laughs> thank, thank you for the help. I appreciate that. I think that's definitely good advice. Have you tried throwing a banana? Also, there's boss fights and shit. I fought this, like, spider boss uh, the, on the first mission, and it was pretty crazy. You gotta, like, take its legs out. So I'm assuming there'll be more bosses, I guess. Oh, this is fucked. Look at all these turrets I have to put down. Fuck, I better do that. All right, turret time. Uh, Fuck you. Here. And they're still and they're still getting in. wish I could like pause. maybe you can I don't know maybe I almost wish you could like pause in between so I can think more about where I'm placing this sh shit I guess that's like when the round ends is when you're able to like think more about what you're doing yeah. all right so Aliens have drastically complicated our unit's paths to their base. It will take too long for them to get there. I'm authorizing the destruction of all bridges in the combat area. Yeah, I was talking about that earlier, if they were going to destroy these bridges. They are. Basic bombardment of the western bridges. Okay. Also, you can fast forward past that, which is cool that they put that in, too. Tower destroyed. Tower destroyed. All right, so are they, yeah. So now that that's like that, it's like. I mean, I don't know. They're not really showing where it's coming from. Oh, now, now they're doing it. I guess you had to wait. This will complicate things for the aliens and make matters easier for us. Prepare the next assault wave. Humans managed to destroy all bridges with a surprise airstrike. Check the layout of all enemy paths. Some of them may have changed. Adjust your defenses accordingly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was going to do. All right, so... All right, this path's coming down here. Can I, like... I still don't know if I can get this one to like merge in with the rest of it. That's like what I wanted to do the whole time. I I, I thought that what was gonna happen is I'd be able to then divert that like somehow when they blow up the bridge. But I guess like like as if they go through the water or something. But I don't think that's gonna be a thing. So forget that. Um, oh, yo, the red. They're showing that this is these are under the path of. So I need to sell these. So hold up. I'm getting these out. I like that they they mark that so that you know that it's like they're like, yo, those those are in danger. So that's good. Here, uh, okay, there, that's an anti-air thing. Um, 
and oh, my plan from before, how I was gonna like divert them. Wait, can I still do that? No, because the bridge is gone. So that whole idea I had earlier, that doesn't exist anymore because the road, that road doesn't exist. Uh, so, oh, also, wait, wait, wait. This is coming out here and, th and they're not going across that bridge anymore. Shit. So they can get like directly in here, huh? And this won't, there's no way I can get them to merge anymore. Fuck. Oh boy. Huh. Okay. Um. So, I need some heavy defenses. They're just gonna be able to get in, I guess. I don't know that there's any way to combine. This is a much more complicated level than the earlier ones. Here, I'm just gonna have a couple things to hopefully slow these guys down. And I want to be able to like take these bombers down. I mean, I think I already am kind of taking them out pretty well. But here, let's put another one in. I'm gonna do another anti-air thing. If I'm, if it'll let me. Oh, I can. Okay. There, that's another anti-air. So hopefully that these bombers aren't a problem. Um, yeah, we'll we'll see how this we'll see how this one goes. And then the other thing is, can I practice this here? Here, maybe. Oh, they don't let you fire here. Do or do they? Oh, wait, maybe they do. Okay, so this mode is. Oh, look how the trees go. By the way, I love how the graphics look, like the water and the trees and everything. It's like really fantastic. Um, so wait, so on the right, let's see. I don't see anything on the right to indicate anything about bombs, so I don't know what you're talking about. Um, so, okay, this one is just like, whoa, look how much you can hold that. Whoa, I didn't know you, this could go so far. Wow, I didn't know you could hold it down that long. So this is this one's just like a crazy like beam you can show, shoot off. This one... This one is just your, kind of like your regular, I guess. Now, which one is this? This is that. That's the, this is the, wait, that's, that's the bomb one. Oh, and in the, in the meantime, it can shoot off like these missiles, which this probably all changes as it goes, because you can buy other things for your ship. So it's like, okay, so like, yeah, it's, it's like sort of twin stick. Okay, so I'm moving around with the left control stick and then I'm firing with the right control stick. So that's like twin stick type of things. But then also uh, with the shoulder button, you can you can do that. Usually what I've been doing is when I'm firing at people, I, I'm like like right there, I'm like shooting, like shooting the thing off because it's, uh, you don't really have enough time, I guess sometimes in battle, but that's kind of cool that you can like really charge it up like all the way all look at that all the way to there and then boom like that'll just take out anything that's awesome so i'm just showing the different like modes that you that you can do so this one at least as of right now doesn't have a shoulder button thing this is just it's the regular twin stick thing so anyway so now that you, you see the different modes uh sailor samara thank you very much for the tier one sub that's way better, just fast forward, skip the cutscenes. I like that because honestly, I don't like story games and then I don't give a shit. Um, so yeah, you know what though, like I'm saying though, the things that they're telling you though in this is all like t teaching you how to play the game. They're not doing very much story stuff in, in this, at least so far. It's very like light on that, it's, om it's almost entirely like like, this is how you do this mission. This is where these turrets should be placed. This is the path that the enemies are coming on. It's all, like, information like that, which is, like, what I like, you know? It's very, like, like serious and strategic. The meter on the right isn't changing to indicate the cooldown after you blow up the, the beam balls. Yeah, I don't, 
That's what I was saying. Like, so I, right? I do that, right? And then it's that. Like, see the bottom, yeah, exactly, the bottom right meter, unless that only happens, like, actually in battle, because, like, we're in between. Like, I don't really know. So I'm learning. I don't see any indicator for that. Um, anyway, so all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna start the next wave. So I'm on wave five of six. So there'll be another one after this too. So, sorry, here we go. I'm gonna start it. I want to like charge this up even more and say, let's do it. And then I kind of missed <laughs> anyway. <laughs> it's like my, I might as well not charge it up all the way because then then you can miss and then you just, like kind of waste all that time. Heavy column destroyed. We're losing this. All right, let me get over here. Got some of this shit, and in the meantime, I'm getting, you know, more yellow uh, money, whatever that I can put down. All right, I better take some of these out. I don't think any of these air things got like anywhere close. Those are getting a little close. How about this over here? I mean, nobody's really getting too close to me, so I, I must have this pretty well laid out. Also, I think I have fire turrets. I think I bought that, but oh, look at this turret doing this. That's the anti-air shit, huh? Yeah, they're not fucking going anywhere. And look, look, I can put down like a ton of stuff. Here, I'm good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put stuff down. If they even make it over here. If they can even make it, they probably can't because they suck. Hostiles. How about a couple more, like over here? Like, what are you gonna do when you make it to this area? You're just gonna fucking die. Here, let's have another one. <laughs> you know? Well, like, what are they gonna do? They're not gonna get it through there. If they do, it'll be like a fucking miracle. Uh, actually, they are kind of getting through. Fuckers. I can always put down another though. Haha, -ha, fuck you. Alright, so that's wave five, right? And then it saves your checkpoint automatically, which is nice. Prepare the final assault. We're attacking with all the forces at our disposal. Our scanners are showing that the final attack is incoming. Survive this assault wave, and the harvester will be safe. So I bel I think that's what they're calling this. So your main uh, thing here, like this, this is I'm calling it my base. I don't know. I guess they they call it technically the the harvester. But so okay, there's a lot of my things here that are in danger. So, so all right. So let's see where these are coming from here. Um, I guess I could just move any that are that are in danger, so let's let's do that first. I'm gonna take out any that are that one I'm worried about taking out because it's like is that gonna make it so they're I, that, you know what that wave of ones that they were had those like drop ships aren't really there anymore so I'm not really too concerned about that where's the other ones that are problematic here so like this one would get like hit and then this one up here would get hit so what i'm gonna do i want this to get fucked up though so like let's hit them right out of the gate with some anti-air let's 
Let's have another one over here. Hopefully that'll take those out. And then over here, I've already got a bunch of anti-air here, but I don't want them getting anywhere near me. I don't think they're going to. What is this right here? Oh, th this is a drop ship thing here, isn't it? I think. Yeah, you see the arrow over here? <laughs> Excuse me. Um, they're, okay, so that's a drop ship. So they're going to come from here. And, yo, I can make, like, one of these anti-air. I don't even need to build another. And then, what about, like, what about this shit? So you can different. Oh, it, that already is. So these will probably get fucked up before even coming. So, okay, so this um, string of planes that it's showing—that's not the uh, bombers. The other, these ones are the bombers. So, uh, yeah. I mean, I feel like I'm like pretty good already, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put in more just to fuck them up. Why not? So I'm gonna put another here. And I'm gonna make that anti-air there, and that's that's like all my money that that I got. Uh, all right, I'm pretty satisfied with that. I'm gonna keep going. Uh, okay, thank you, uh, Finger Guns. Thank you very much for the tier one sub. Boxy says I'm drunk, high, eating a hot pocket, watching Mike stream. Sounds good to me. Um, I mean, hell, hot pocket. Let's just put, I should, I want to do a stream where I do nothing but have Hot Pocket commercials. Let's just do a, like a food commercial stream where do like Hot Pockets and um, Polaner All Fruit. Can you please pass the jelly? Uh, how about chicken tonight? I feel like chicken tonight, like chicken tonight. We could just do that. I just want that. And then uh, I guess it could be gum commercials, all that. No, no toy commercials. It'll just be all. It'll just be all like food related. Rice aroni. There you go. That would be in there. <laughs> the Wawa. They have it. They ha there's Wawa commercials. They're like weird, but yeah, they exist. Does this game still hold up? Uh, still, I don't know. I, what, this game? What about like uh, so? The, a couple days ago, I was streaming Atari seventy eight hundred. Like, and you're asking me if this game that came out what like three or four years ago still holds up? <laughs> does this like does this still hold up? God, it's so it's so old. This game, God. <laughs> Mr. Do still holds up. It does. Mr. Fucking Mr. Do holds up. So, like, what do you want? All right, I'm going to start this wave. Prepare strike forces Alpha Charlie Tango. Is this Come retro? From no. I say again, attack from the north. You're asking me if this is a retro game. <laughs> or are you just giving him shit because... Yeah, I see what you're just saying. Yeah, God, this game's so old. Is this a uh, God? It's, it looks like a retro game to me. Yeah, exactly. God, it's so old and outdated. Why would you even play that? I only play the newest games that came out uh, this week. And then I move on to the next game immediately. These are, are these are fucking. This is a problem here. I'm gonna have to put in some more anti-air. Yeah, I'm gonna do that right now. Actually, here. Do it. I hate building in the middle of doing this. I better get over here. 
Okay. Yeah, you cannot be here. There. How about that? Is it, the placement's like horrible. I know. Okay, let's use the. Well, I'm gonna try the bomb thing. Here, let's go. Oh, this is not it. It's this. Okay, here we go. Let me do another one. See, it does, it does like it's farting. <laughs> Here, now I can do it. There. I, I think that needs like a better, I wonder if you can get like a, an improvement for the cooldown on that, because that like, it takes too long. That makes me not want to use it yet until I get some kind of like faster way to drop those. If that's a thing, I hope I hope it is. I mean, there's so much, there's so many upgrades and shit in this. It's like this is definitely a game that you can put a lot of time into. I think. Jet fighters in the zone, attacking the aliens. have massacred our elite assault squad. Boom. We've lost this battle. We are ceasing all attacks. Good, get the fuck here. out. I say again, cease all attacks. Cease your attack, get out. Congratulations, human forces have been obliterated. We can now proceed with expanding the core. Each core that is expanded on the surface increases our energy potential on this planet. This allows us to use more technologies. Proceed to the next operation site. See how it's all turning like techno like technological ground. It's like a techno astroturf <laughs> that we're placing down or whatever. I just like that. It, dude, it's totally like um, it's, we're turning the planet into Cybertron, pretty much. We're the Decepticons. They're like, oh, look at this planet. It's got trees. It's got water. Well, not for long. <laughs> It turning it into New Jersey. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. X more defense. All right. So, ooh, we're going to Germany. I'm I'm half German, so let's go. I'm going to take it I'm going to take it over. And then you got Australia, Russia, US. Look at all these. Jeez. Oh, Japan is at the end. That's as far as it goes. Oh, oh, well, USA is in there. Uh, okay. I wonder if it goes on... I guess this is just the, the main campaign. I wonder if it goes, like... If it goes on beyond this. Um, oh, I hope there's, like, the pyramids here. It looks like there will be. That's cool. I like I like how the USA is just like like that's what they use. They couldn't use like you know the Grand Canyon or something. It, it just looks like it's just like all like sh shitty like streets and like factories. That's what that's that's what they do. <laughs> that's what they do. Man, it is uh, well, good. Oh, it look, okay. So yeah, there, New Jersey. It will be. All right, but for now, we're we're gonna do Germany. It's so funny. Um, all right, so I only have one technology here. I guess I didn't do too great. So, okay, uh, there's technologies, and then there's, like, upgrades. I don't have upgrades, but this is basically, like, your tree of stuff you can get. When it's orange, that means I have it. So, so far I have, I have the plasma, charge plasma, plasma shield, which the plasma shield's pretty good. That's all good. Uh, and then missiles, I'm working on that. So this is, like... EMP blast for my ship. I mean, that might be cool. These are all locked right now, so maybe I have to buy all the rest of these 
first, and then time warp. Slows down time while the X-Morph ship is charging the dark matter attack. It makes it easier to precisely place the bomb in the heat of the battle. I mean, that's probably good to have. Let's see about the turrets, though. So the turrets... Um, so what I have so far, is, this is the first thing, just the, the regular plasma tower. Then you can get all this other stuff. So, uh, okay, I, I have that already. Uh, oh, so I do not have the flamethrower yet. But this is, I have anti-air. I have that. I don't have this. And I only have one technology thing, so I can't even buy that right now. So it's like I could save my money or I could just like, I could, I could buy this. Um, I think I'm just gonna buy that. I'm gonna buy this. Might, might as well. So that, that's what I bought. So what we just bought is the EMP blast when charged and releasing creates a strong electromagnetic pulse. All right, so that's what I got. Um, I mean, honestly, I, this is probably also the type of game where you gotta go back to previous levels, I'd imagine, but I haven't had to do that yet. Remember that other game I was playing where I had to like just continually like go back to the first level? I haven't done that at all yet, but I, eventually I'm sure I will need to. All right, so. Yeah, that's just like stuff on the side of the screen. Here we go. Establish a strong presence in this region and stifle any opposition. Additionally, we will connect to the energy infrastructure. This will increase our power even further. The X Morph have landed in Berlin. They're trying to take control over all of Europe. We can't let this happen. After the failure in okay. Great Britain, the British have placed the remainder of their air force under my command. I've already called in heavy bomber support, but it's going to take some time before it arrives. We have to react quickly. I'm sending in a large number of fast attack vehicles against the X-Morph core. A large number of enemy vehicles is quickly moving in on our location. Block their paths to gain more time to destroy them. Yeah, so it's like, so the, I, forget, I forget what the first one is, maybe it's like Canada. It's like when the aliens like land originally, it's like, okay, so the humans have the resources to be like, all right, we're fighting in Great Britain, we're fighting in whatever, Egypt, we're fighting in Japan, we're fighting in all these different places. It's like, how about right from the beginning, as soon as the aliens, like, land, all, everything, everything the planet Earth has, throw it at them, like, right at the beginning. Why, why is it like, okay, we're gonna have a little battle over here, oops, we lost. Or we're gonna have a little battle over here, oh, we lost again. We're gonna have a little battle over in New Jersey. Oh, we lost again. We're gonna have a little battle over in Las Vegas or whatever. Oh, we lost again. Just like, go at, like, give them everything you got, like, right from the beginning. Like, why is it all these, like, little battles? Like, it should be, like, like fuck me up so hard. Like, when the aliens land, fuck them up so hard. Like, that they're just, you kill them, and then, then it's over, and then you can get back to, you know, jerking off. <laughs> like, why is it all these, like, little battles? This is going to get blown up, isn't it? Like, don't you think? Look, I got to look at what's going on here. So, okay. They're com they're going to come out of here. What's going to happen? This is going to definitely get blown up, I think. Don't you think? Um, they're going to come along here, and then they're going to, like, get... They're going to get to the... They're going to get to the base, right? Then this shit... They're coming along here. So you know what I want to do? I want to divert this. They're gonna they're gonna come down here. I want to divert them so that they go to the right. I think. So what I'm gonna try to do. I don't know if this is gonna work too hot. You know what I should do? I should do it here. Let's do it. 
here and here. And we're gonna create the fence. Okay, see that only diverted them to there. That's not good enough. So next, we need to do one here and we need to do one here. And then we're gonna make the little fence in between. See, now, now I've diverted this to where it's they're going like this. And also the whole time they're gonna be getting shot by my turrets. So now that this is all like lined up, that's pretty good. And then they're, they have a path to get to the base. Um, they don't have like any air things going on yet. It's all, I think this is all gonna be ground. Um, so the next thing is, so these guys, like, I don't know how this is going to go with this, so... They are going to come down like this. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put one here. I haven't done this one yet, so I don't really know exactly where to place all this. I mean, that'll fuck them up, I guess. I'm going to do that. That might be a bad idea. I don't really know where to place them right now. So, like, a good place is going to be, like, this. Oh, and they're coming out of here, too. So, like, I need to put some, like, shit over here. This is going to be... This will be interesting. I don't know. This might go terribly. Let's try it. Wave one. I didn't. Your support ready. We've okay. Got your back. Over. I didn't know I was gonna get those additional ones. I mean, that's good. All right, there's the air defense shit. Fuck them. Air support ready. We've got your back. Over. So basically, I need to be like right in this area where everything's merging together here. Fuck. Uh-oh. Um, shit. Jetpack is in the zone. Attacking the aliens. Here, I need, I need a turret down. That's something. Core's under attack. Oh, oh, by one little fuck got in. Piece of shit. Response units have been destroyed. I'm sending in a tank assault force. Maybe they are. I don't have more money to do that. The X Morph destroyed our initial attack wave. Heavy attack units aren't ready for a counter strike yet, but the aliens haven't had. Uh, pee in my cup. Thank you very much for the sub. I very much appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you for the support. Pee in my cup. <laughs> Pretty sure 80% of the people in here have mental problems. Uh, I do too, though. So we're all like, we're, we're peas in a pod or pee in my cup. See what I did there? Um, yeah, anyway, I'm hoping that with this stream, um, maybe by watching me play this, some people will look at this and, and then maybe they'll find a game that they'll enjoy themselves and then it'll give you guys something to do later when you're, whatever you're doing, you're, they're drinking their whiskey and they're doing whatever you guys do, peeing in your cup or whatever you're doing. And in the meantime, you can, you, it's another game for you to play. 
you know? Or remember the other stream I did, like the Atari 7800? You could get an Atari 7800 off of eBay if you don't have one and go to town with that. I don't know. I'm just hoping that uh, with these streams, sometimes, you know, some, some of the games I play, you're going to look at and you'll be like, I'm never going to play that. But hopefully sometimes you'll see me play a game. You'll be like, oh, maybe I'll try that. So that's all this is. It's just another stream where it's like maybe you'll we'll see me play this and think it's cool. And then maybe you'll get it yourself to play while you're drinking your whiskey. Uh, Alraz, thank you very much for the tier three sub. Appreciate that. You saw a 7800 on eBay for $94. I don't know what they go for these days. Um, my 7800 was mo was a modded one. Um, so, I I mean, honestly, like, I would say I'd probably try to find one that at least has, like, AV on it, you know? Or, like, I don't know. I, we inspired you to get an Atari Jaguar. I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, there's a few things that are all right on there. You, if you have an Atari Jaguar, uh, get Tempest at least. At least, if, Listen, if you have the Jaguar and you have Tempest, that's all you really need. And then if you find another game beyond that that you like, um, great. <laughs> You know, uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put more things around here because they're gonna start. Oh, see this shit? Hmm. I'm gonna put them closer to base. I'm gonna put one here. Actually, what if I put it right here and then they, they gotta kinda go by it here? I guess I could put in two. Fuck it, let's do it. Um, I mean, listen, I did, a, I did a few Atari Jaguar streams like last month or not too long ago or two months ago or something like that and uh, there's a couple thing. There, basically, it's mostly that Tempest game which is really, really good. Um, what else was like, all right. There was like one or two other games that I thought were like, all right, but there's like very little. But I'll tell you what, man, that Tempest game, that's worth the price of admission right there. So I, I will say that much. At the very at the very least, it's got that. I, I could play that fucking game all, all day. That's a good fucking game. Uh, Neo Geo, thank you very much for the sub. Cyber Morph. Uh, I, I'm not, I don't really like that one that much. How do you pick up the debris? Wait, what? You mean like in this? What do you mean? Do you mean like the, the turrets? I don't know what you're saying. Why is there a pretzel? You know why there's a pretzel. If I have to answer that question again, you already know the answer. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna start this next wave. Air support ready. Got your back. Over. Why down an apple? I mean, I'd I'd rather eat a pretzel. It's about what I like. I mean, I like apples, but yo, know, I love some soft uh, pretzels. That's why, because I like it. I mean, what do you want it to be? Like, I had to fucking pick something. My response units have been destroyed. I'm sending in a tank assault force. Russians attacking the Piece 
of shit. Time to put one down. Put two down. Put two down. Good. Oh my god. Oh my god. It never ends. Holy shit, it never ends. Oh fuck. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I, I'm in trouble here. Oh, did I actually? Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck him up! Piece of fuck? Holy shit. Our units are being massacred by the aliens. Like, We're changing you goddamn right you are. We're trying to destroy their defenses. I'm calling in mobile artillery. Artillery ready to attack alien structures. Watch out for enemy artillery attacks. Basic tower is not the reach to destroy artillery plants. Defend them yourself, or upgrade your basic tower to an artillery tower. Are they not already artillery towers? Hang on. Like, which ones aren't? Maybe they're not. Shit, hang on. Let's see. What, what is, oh. Hey, you fuck. I was gonna fix the other ones. This is the, I thought that I was on this. A large number of enemy artillery units is incoming. It is recommended to place artillery towers at the front to protect other towers. I don't know what, wait. I don't know if these are already, it doesn't really like say, hang on. So like that one. So that's anti-air, that's like the fence thing. I don't know what this, Uh, like arrow one is like what is what is that or oh does that just mean you can move it impossible so I mean I'm gonna assume that there, those already are artillery units like I don't even know are you thinking about finishing up with gimmick? What? Mr. G you mean Mr. Gimmick? I I don't I that I, I don't know man that's like not on my mind right now. Um like uh I don't know maybe someday I'd come back to it I, I guess. No, am I thinking about it? No, I'm not thinking about it. Not Definitely not at this moment while I'm trying to figure out the art artillery towers in this game. I'm not thinking about Mr. Gimmick. Sorry. You don't think the, a laser fence has artillery? You are now, yeah, apparently. So like, okay, if I just put one down here, right? Like that looks the same as the other ones, so. I have no idea. And then that really, yeah, that does just mean to move it. So I don't know is the answer to this. Is I have no fucking idea. Um, all right, so I guess I'm just gonna try it and see. So like these ones, what ones are, what are those? These are, these are ones the game put down. Those ones look different. Do I not have the ability to put 
down art, art, artillery towers. Like I don't fucking even know which ones. I wish it, I kind of wish like you could click on it and would say like if I would like click on it, it doesn't actually tell you what's what. You have to like know the symbols, I guess. I don't fucking know the symbols. Uh, Pantera one two one eight. Thank you for the sub. So, all right, I'm just gonna put down towers, I guess, and see what happens. Like, I don't fucking know. One thing I do know, though, is the more shit I have near this, the better protected it'll be. That's all, that's about all I can do because I have no fucking idea because they don't fucking tell you. I think I think that you should. I think that you should be able to click a thing and it should like text should come up next like next to it and tell you what it is. Because I have no fucking idea. You know, I know eventually you would, like, learn that, but, like, it would be nice to have. Anyway, um, all right, I'm going to, I guess I'm going to start it, and we'll see if these all get destroyed. Gunships attacking the alien. <laughs> guess we're going to find out. Is there enough assholes on me here? Jeez. Oh, more, huh? They don't want me fighting the... Uh, yeah, like this shit over here. Let's see what's going on. It is, it is under attack. So that's not an artillery tower, then, I guess. Fuck. How do you fucking upgrade it and so on? I, I, like, I thought I had bought those. I was pretty sure I, was, I, I like had that in my like tree of things that I could put down. The aliens have repelled our attack. I'm sending in more artillery with repair unit support. <sighs> Alright, let's... God damn it. Alright, build mode. Let's see. So, like... I'm trying to see if there's more... Oh, how did I fucking do that? This is it. Wait, it's this. How did I do that? Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I'm like learning how to fucking play this. So you, okay, you click this, and then you hit A again, and it brings you to this. Okay, here we go, and that's the artillery. Okay, I didn't know how to get to that, and that's the anti-air. Okay, there we go. And then later, I'm going to get the flamethrower and whatever all this other shit is. Okay, now I'm good. So now we're going to put... And what does it look like? It's one of those. So hold up. Is that the same as that? Yeah. That. Okay, so listen. That's the artillery tower. The little. So, the, so what they're doing is the little. Instead of having text, the little icon there, that means. Mm, well, whatever those are, like the regular plasma towers. That's like your basic one, like down there. This is artillery. Okay. That's artillery. I don't know if you can make these ones that are connected to a fence into artillery ones. I guess I'm gonna I'm gonna try it to see. So let's say, so you do that. Oh, it also widens the. Look at how much it widens the range of it. Ooh. Let, let's do that. Let's see if it. Hopefully, it doesn't take the fence away. It doesn't. Okay, great. All right, all right. I'm starting to know what I'm doing slightly, slightly more, like one percent more. Um, okay, those are artillery. So where are these fuckers gonna be coming from? Let's. Ma I'm gonna make this one into one too. 
Oh fuck, I sold it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Hit the wrong button. Here. And then you do that. There we go. And then you do that. Okay, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Now, so I have two more that I can, like, fuck with here. So, you know what I could do? Should I have one of these? Let's have this be one. Now, that one is... I don't want them all to be, but... And what about over here? Like, yeah, one of these fucks could come out. And then they're traveling. Yeah, they're traveling right down to this base. See, this is a problem. Um, shit. I, you know what I need? I need to divert this. Fuck. Hang on a second. We have a problem. So if this can go, even if it goes that way, I have to get it to go all the way over there. So I would need... Fuck. I need more money. Yo, I gotta divert this thing. I need one. Oh man, I need one more. I'm gonna sell something. I'm gonna sell one of these, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna sell that. And then I'm gonna put this here. And I'm gonna create a fence in between. And it, it diverted it to there, which isn't, still isn't enough. I'm gonna need another set, of another fence, and then it would go along this and then connect to that, which is what I want to happen, but I don't have the money for it. As soon as I'm able to do that, I'll do that. But that's like about the best I can do at the moment. Unless, wait a second. Hold up, I got a bet. I got a better idea yet. Um, I'm gonna. This might also be a bad idea. I'm gonna try it. Hang on a second. I'm gonna. Shit. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna put them down here. And then put the fence in. At least it's getting them to all merge down to this area. You know what? And then since they're not going to go down this path, now I have to sell these. Hang on a second. I'm trying to be a little smarter about this. So, also this should probably be a artillery. And then, you know what we do? We put more fucking shit over here. Because they're all going to merge over this area, or, or a lot of it is. Fuck, I, oh, I keep hitting the wrong button. When you, so when you're like on this menu, if you go to that and you hit A, it like, it, it takes it away. So you have to be on that, then hit A, and then it flips it to the next thing. So, all right, so... From here, we're gonna do um, that, another artillery. And then I have one more I can put down. Um, so yeah, these are gonna come from here. These are coming from here. And like, here, I'll, I'll put another like normal one in here. There we go. I think that's pretty set up pretty well. Cause like these guys, these guys that come out of, out of this out here, they have to go through this, and they should get ra rather fucked up, and I'm gonna be here, like, fucking them up, you know? The guys that come from up here also have to go through this area. All the people that come through there, you know, have to come through that. So, like, this is pretty, pretty good. As long as these, as long as these guys here don't make it past this, so I'll put I'll put in more shit over here when I can. And even if they do, they come they come down this path and then they come all the way down here. And then I well I have, <laughs> I have one thing which is I guess better than nothing. But oh look at all the fucking things I have over here, dude. And then yeah, if they try to get through here, they're all fucked. They're they're fucked. 
I got this is they're I'm I, I'm good. They're fucked. The point is these hu these humans are fucked. Human. What are you gonna do? Shit. What's going on over here? Yeah, this needs to be here. Shit. I definitely need the, oh, more of these to be like. Oh, this is this is rough. Oh my god. 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 What's happening here? Oh, okay. Oh my god, dude. I'm getting fucked up. I guess my ship's health gradually comes back. I didn't even realize that. Oh my god. The Exmorph have reinforced their defenses with artillery towers, but we've got an answer to this. Bulldog tanks can withstand artillery fire and will pave a way to the alien core. If they can't break through, then we might have to sacrifice the city and call in the prototype Jaguar Type S tank. Oh, they're calling in the Jaguar. Uh-oh. Um... You got it. So they're gonna come out and fuck me up, basically, right? I'm just worried about. I mean, they can resist the uh, artillery. See, now I want everything to just be like a fucking artillery thing because it's like. I mean, and a lot of them are. Because I'm worried about these ones that can destroy my, like, towers. You know? I don't know, maybe I don't want everything to be... I should probably have one down here. I'm gonna make one of these into artillery. I guess. I have two more. I mean, this is the battle zone right here, right? It's like, that's pretty much where this shit's going down. And then, wait, well, not entirely, though. Wait, there's this problem, too. Oh, shit, dude, I almost forgot about this area. Hold up. If I were to... So these guys are coming out of here. Can I divert them to all go over there? Hang on a second. That's really not gonna work. Oh, I guess you can't. Because these two don't connect. I think that's what the triple lines mean, is that you can't divert that. Fuck. So I'm gonna need more things along this path. Yeah, because they can get like right in. Fuck. And, and there's nothing I can really do about it. Oh, boy. All right, well, let's see how it goes. Super Heavy Bulldog Tanks reporting on the battlefield. We'll break through alien fire and head straight for the core. Air support ready. We've got your back. Over. Is that a healing thing? Does that heal the enemies? Those the green shit? Oh my god. We don't want that. These are strong as shit, too, by the way. 
What the fuck? Holy shit. How are these so fucking strong? What the fuck? Maybe I, oh my god. Did that even like do anything? Fuck. Oh my god. Um. Oh, I'm in so much trouble here. Oh, this is gonna be real bad. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Fuck him up! Jeez! Oh my god. Tell me there's not more of those coming. Wait, how do you fuck these tanks up better? <laughs> what do I gotta do about these tanks? There's something... There's... Oh no. They're like, build more defenses. Guess so, huh? Here, wait. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Holy shit! You get out of here. Oh my god, I made it. Even the super heavy bulldog tanks weren't able to destroy the Exmorph core. Goddamn right. Fortunately, the reinforcements from Britain are finally here. We're going to squash the aliens with German tanks and blow them to hell with British bombers. <laughs> Prepare our forces for a joint air and ground full frontal assault against the Exmorph core. They're gonna. They're okay. They're bringing in tanks from like 19. You know, 40 versus these aliens that just landed. They're like, all right, so we got these tanks um, from 1940, and uh, they're in, like, uh, our garage. Don't, don't worry. We, we, we're, only, we're only versus the aliens now who have uh, technology from 10 million years in the future. We'll be fine. Everything will be fine. <laughs> It's like, what are you gonna do? What are you, you the, I'm sorry, but the, the humans are gonna fucking, they're fucked versus these fucking aliens. Like, all right, let's put this here. Anti-air. And this is shit's gonna come and we're gonna do another anti-air. I, I can't let these bombers like get to my, Anti-air. Let's anti-air the fuck out of these cocksuckers. Oh, that's not good. Take that away. I mean, it's only a couple. Oh, I can only do one more. Fuck. And then they're gonna come in, like, all the way over here. This is just all so rough. And then there's this situation going on. Oh, my God. Here. Once they get around here, it's like... I don't know. I only got so much money here. I heard you're the penis doctor. Can you tell me why my penis is blue? Oh, you're choking it too too hard. Probably, I would imagine, right? A little bit lighter. <laughs> there you go. This looks complicated. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of things going on. <laughs> so I guess I, a little bit is fun though. I mean, I like, I love, I love these type, type of games. So I mean, like, uh, but there, yeah, there's a lot going on. 
Um, all right, let's, I'm gonna start this next wave. What are we on here? Oh, six of seven. This has seven waves, so there's this one and then the next wave. I need to go a little lighter on my penis, if you don't say. So, Mike, my big cock. My big cock? What about my big cock? Choke, they're saying, wait, somebody else is saying, you're choking your chicken too much. We all know that it's hard to stop. Yeah. Mike's big cock. What about my big cock? Can you legally name yourself penis? Um, that's a really good question. You're gonna look that up? Okay, let us know. Can you, if, can you name yourself that? that that's, I don't know, I don't know. Why not? What the hell? All right, I'm gonna start this. This is wave six of seven. Mars entering danger zone. En route to release payload and alien structures. Oh my god, oh my god. That's not good. Oh no. Oh no. Fuck. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> wow. Okay. Fuck. You know what happened? I was making fun of their tanks from 1940, and I was like, oh, what are they, what can they, what can the fucking guys come in with their fucking tanks from 1940, and, and the aliens are like, oh shit. <laughs> of course. Of course. All right. Um, shit. Lionheart8278, thank you very much for the sub. What do you think of their 1940s tanks now? I think they fucked me up, like, hard. 
All right, so we went back to the wave I was on. All right, so like. Oh. I think this is a mess. I need to like oh, divert them better. Here, I'm gonna have to like totally like rearrange this or something here. Because clearly this arrangement is not working out at all. Here, let's see. I'm, ch I'm changing, I'm changing the setup. I'll leave that. So, th oh, hang on a second. So these bombers can't get, they can't get there. They can't get to the base. So I need, here, let's have an anti. Can I put another one in? I'm just gonna try to change the setup. So, yo. I want to at least not have to worry about these bombers. Like to the point where it's like they are not even going to get there. So I just put in a couple more, so hopefully that's enough. <sighs> Alright, so the other problem was the main base was just getting fucked by all these guys that were just, they're just flying in. They're just flying in and like, I'm just like fucked. So like, would the anti-air ones take out those ships? So if I make all these anti-air, maybe that'll help. Like I don't even I don't even know. And then there there's also like tank units and shit. Let's make. All right, and now I'm like out of money. All right, I'm gonna try that. Let's try this arrangement and say I don't fucking even know, man. Bombers entering danger zone. Our route to release payload from alien structures. Lionheart, you're good. I I know you're just messing around or whatever. I was messing around too. You're totally good. I was busting your balls. anti-air is fucking all these guys up. Oh, yeah, what are, the, what are you gonna do now? Air support, protecting aliens. Oh, yeah, suck my fucking fat dick. Yeah, yeah, what are you gonna do? Here, let's have another anti-air, actually. What are, you, what are you fucking gonna do now? Yeah, run, run away, bitch! What are you gonna fucking do? You're gonna run away, like a little bitch. <laughs> what are you gonna even do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Mike is the alien? I am! They can't do shit, these fucking humans. Fuck. 
Again. No. Oh no, it's over. Fuck. Thank you, Untold Darkness, for the tier one sub. Is that the seventh wave or is that still the sixth wave? Oh, did I, was that the, I don't know if that was the last one. Did I beat the sixth or is that still the sixth? Uh, oh, this is still, it is still wave six or seven. Know if I have to, I don't fucking know. Oh my god! <laughs> you know what I feel like? All right. <sighs> I need a new plan. anti-air, that's anti-air, anti-air. Uh, I'll, I'll let those stay, I guess. I don't even know. Nah, maybe not. Eh, fine, fuck it. Here's, here's what's up. They're, they all get over here. No, no matter what I do, they're all they're all fucking getting over to my base. Appa apparently, so like, at this point, like, I know this is not probably not what I'm supposed to be doing, but like, I don't fucking even know. It's like, fine, come get over to my base, then you gotta fucking deal with this. You're just gonna get fucking blown away the entire time you're here, so. All right, so now some of these that are here, let's make this like, here, let's have that be an anti-air. Okay, this one's, this one's gotta come out. Let's make that one artillery. 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 This one's coming out. I gotta just make more of these like artillery maybe. Artillery. Let's make one of these ones, artillery. Maybe like an, I don't know, an anti-air or something, like. 
this pro this method this is probably not gonna work, but I'm like, I don't know, I'll fucking try anything. Air. You know what? I'm gonna also have this be anti-air. Cause that's like near that. So alright. I don't know. It's a different attempt, a, a tr you know, something different. Let's try it. Probably won't work, but Let's see what I can do. things right because those destroy the towers right if you got none of these like what are you gonna do Fuck! 
fuck out of here. Fuck out. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Time to combat test our most powerful weapon. I'm calling in the prototype Jaguar Type S tank. I mean, I made it barely. We haven't tested it in an environment like this before. Tough luck, soldier. This is war. There's no time for testing. Berlin endured tougher battles. If there is no road, then make one. Thank you. 
Put it down. What do you mean impossible? It's not impossible. Put the fucking thing down, you dumb shit. Fuck! I hate that EMP shit! The fucking EMP shit. Anything like this in my life. Oh, my God, when does he die?
have to slow down. Slow down? Both participants, we are red hot. We have to slow down even further. We suffered defeat. The aliens destroyed the Jaguar tank. We don't have any more capable units in Germany. However, it looks like the Jaguar Type S has seriously threatened the aliens. We'll analyze this battle and create new war machines that will finally defeat them. The Russians and Japanese have already made some progress. Holy in crap. Regard. We can power up our cores. We are the Borg. We will transfer our consciousness. Wow, dude, how strong is that? Was that fucking tank? What, was I working on that tank for like thirty minutes? Holy shit! See, I told you. That, so at the end of each one, there's like a, a boss, or most of them. The first one you do, it's like a spider thing, and you take its legs out, which was really cool. But the the tank was fucking hard. It was like way more difficult. So that was Germany. Oh, look at how we're taking over the world here. This is great. Um, eventually, the entire world will just be all Cybertron. Okay, so... Um, oh, do I go back here? I guess I haven't done... I haven't done this, huh? Okay, and that's... All right, there's, like, a lot. Wow. All right, I'm gonna take a quick break. We'll come back and then um, I'll do more. I guess I'm gonna go back to Argentina here. Um, and then also, oh, I have four technologies. Hang on a second, let me do this first. Um, so, okay, wait, this is electromagnetic field that protects it from missile, that protects it from missiles. I mean, maybe. What's this? Oh, we can get the first. Oh, laser. I can get laser. Or should I finish out these other ones? See this time warp thing? I don't like even. I'm not even gonna know how to use that. Probably. I feel like I should put money into like the towers. What's the, what's this? Faster movement. Oh, faster movement for my main ship. Fucking yes. Oh, wait, that's an upgrade. I have no upgrades. God damn it. Wait a second, what are these? Stronger core, that I want. Core shockwave. Protects the core, I kind of want those. So, ugh, th these will be great to get. I don't have any upgrades though, so okay. So I guess I'm gonna use, I mean, I could do these like flamethrower towers. There's so much stuff. Yo, and then flame artillery tower. That's what I want. I'm gonna get that. Flame artillery tower, fuck yeah. And then anti-air stuff, right? So this is, you can do an anti-air missile tower or an anti-air laser tower. Should we have some fucking laser beams going? I got two things left to do. Or it's like I could start doing the flamethrower thing. I kind of want to like level up one of these. I find, I think I want to do, that's pretty, I mean, shit. The power of these is really strong, but it's like slower, huh? Or this, that's pretty good. I'm, I think I'm gonna go for missile, anti-air missile tower. I have to make sure to use that if I'm gonna do that, though. And then, wait, what was this one again? Um, oh yeah, and then these. It's like when I'm charging up, the ship emits electromagnetic magnetic field that protects it from missiles and rockets. I mean, a lot. I'm like charging up a lot when I shoot. I should probably get that. You know what? I'm gonna get that, and I'm gonna get should I get this time warp thing? 
it slows down time while the ship is charging the oh the bomb you know what? i tend to not use the bomb that much i see what i really want for that is like Well, wait, that's why it's charging it. So basically that is what will give me more time to wait for the bomb. That That's the thing I was looking for, for the bomb, pretty much. I mean, that's the way this game does it. It slows down time so that you have more time to what, wait for the slowdown to happen or to wait for the cooldown to get by, basically, I think is what that means. Um, and then I can use the bomb more because right now the bomb I feel like is useless. I should, I guess, I should have that. I wonder how that works though. I guess I need to figure that out. All right, I guess I'm getting that because as of right now, I haven't been switching to the bomb very much because it takes time for it to like recharge. So, what I really, really want though is the upgrades. I don't know how to get the upgrades exactly because I want to I want the ship to be faster that would be really helpful and then what was this faster ship repair oh my god I want that like what's all that and then debris collector wait what is it Sucks in debris from the enemies. Gathering debris adds resources, which can be used to build defense towers. Oh, shit. Dude, I didn't even know it worked like that. Wait a second. So when you kill an enemy, are you supposed to be in the ghost mode or something to pick up the debris and that's how you get the towers back or something? Like, I didn't even... Real, know that I, I need to know more about the debris collecting shit there's a lot a lot to know here uh, I didn't even realize that this is the second time you've been fucked by Dairy Queen what happened to Dairy Queen is this on PS5 uh, I don't know you have to look it up I'm not sure it should be if it's not. I mean, I'm playing it with a control. I'm playing this on Steam. I'm playing it with a controller, but uh, if it's not on PS5, it should be. They should put it on there if it's not. This is definitely a cool game. I think it's just an upgrade that gives you more. Yeah, but what about, like, um, normally? So forget about the upgrade for it. Um, like so just to show it on screen while i'm talking about it so like the debris collector forget about the upgrade for it what about just normally when i'm going around so i'm like supposed to be collecting debris do i have to be in ghost mode to do that or am i collecting it like normally when i'm destroying ships and is that how that's how the yellow in the bottom left is charging so that i can put more towers down that's how that's working i guess get the ghost vacuum right <laughs> seriously This looks better than the tower defense game you played the last time. It's, this is way better. <clears throat> what cock ring are you using? Oh, many. Put like 40 of them. Just try different things. You'll see the pieces on the ground after you blow things up. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention to that. This looks really fun. I definitely want to check this out at some point. Yeah. Um, okay. So anyway, so I got the I got the upgrades. You know what? Let me just start the mission. I'm gonna take a break in a second, but I'm gonna I think I'm gonna start the next mission first. Um, so let's continue. And now we're in we're doing Argentina or something. Losing towers. Some enemies like artillery towers can be can destroy your towers. Losing a tower in the middle of an enemy wave can drastically change the situation. Right. As all laser fences are connected, to will disappear as well. Right, falling bridges can also destroy your defense. Oh, when a tower is destroyed, you will regain your resources. Oh, you get your resources back if the tower is destroyed. Wow, just as if it was sold. That's interesting. That's kind of nice, actually. You can always. So then it's like. You don't have to really worry then about your towers being destroyed if you kind of get it back anyway. Okay. That's kind of nice news. 
You can always rebuild the Lost Towers, but this can prove difficult in the middle of a battle. Yeah, absolutely. Building in the middle of the battle is tough. Alright, so... Like that piece of dialogue right there didn't that was that right there was a little bit more like refinery. They probably want to stop our fuel production and claim our resources. This cannot happen. Losing these supplies would drastically limit our defensive capabilities. So there, okay, those two things were like kind of story. So there is like a little bit of story stuff. Usually when they're giving you information, it's usually specifically about the, the game. But here and there, there is like a little bit. Okay, so, but anyway, let's look at this map. Um, so basically they're gonna be, you know what they do, I gotta tell you, is they expand the map in the middle also. So so I might be like, oh, I don't have to worry about guys coming from the left, right? Well, n not right now I don't, but later, by the time we get to, you know, wave five or whatever, they'll probably expand the map and then I'm gonna have guys coming from the left. I mean, I don't have to worry about that right now, but so what I really want to do here is I know eventually guys are going to come from here and blow and shit, so, but, but not yet. So it's like, and I bet you they're going to come from like down here too or something at some point, right? So like how, what do I, how do I want to handle this? Um, I mean, I can always move shit, right? So it's like, that's fine. I mean, this is this right here at the moment is the point where they're like all coming together. So I'll just, for the moment, I'm just gonna put stuff here, just for now. Actually, I can make their path longer to get to me, too. Hang on a second. That's probably what I should be doing. I'm gonna block this off, is what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna totally block this off. Well, and then... <sighs> There's like a lot of choices here. All right, so here. I'm gonna put one here. I'm gonna put one here. I'm gonna try to block it off. So that makes them all go up there, right? So then we're gonna block it off again. Right, so I'm gonna have one here. I have one here. There we go. So now they have a longer path to get up here. They all have to go up here. And then, pretty much like this area is where they're all sort of converging, so. I don't know if this is the best idea of what I'm doing right now, but I guess we're gonna see. And then I can have an artillery unit, I guess. I know it's not much going on. And then, so the problem with what I just did is like, I did do some blocking off, which is good, like probably overall, but these are kind of, like these ones down here aren't even really gonna come into play then. But, but they might later. I think I'll leave it like this. I'm gonna try it. I'll try it, I don't know. This, this might not be a good layout. I, this definitely could be like that. This is not a good, no, here, I'm sorry, I'm gonna restart, it has a restart, right? Oh, look at that, the game has a restart. 
Now it's oh, it goes all the way back to here. Jeez, that was further back than I wanted. Okay. Ugh. I thought it was just gonna like start. Don't do the yeah. At least you can skip it. Alright, so anyway. The X4 for blended next to the refinery. They probably want to stop our fuel production. I'm I'm like resources. redoing what I was doing. This cannot happen. Losing these supplies would drastically limit our defensive capabilities. I was not happy with that. Not at all. And I'll just change it later. Here, let's make one of this uh, into. Oh, I'm gonna do this instead. All right, that's my that's my new setup. And then, as long as I take out these these guys, I think the green ones are the ones that take out my towers, right? So, I mean, there's I'm learning here. There's like certain ones that can take my towers out. Here, now I gotta take these planes down. Alright, where's the other group of planes? I guess I could try this here. <laughs> there, that's me trying the... Fuck. Fuck. Oh, they just fucked me up. Oh wow, I'm getting fucked up already. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. Okay, well this is a bad start. God damn it, seriously? Does this, does this repair itself? Like, I don't know. God damn, that's not good. I almost like want to just restart the whole thing. I don't know if the. It's going to be hard to reach the X Warp core in this terrain. <sighs> We've developed a new type of unit for such scenarios. Fuck. Deployed for <laughs> assault infantry. What is this? Warning. We are detecting a new kind of human threat. These units can jump over laser fences and terrain obstacles. Calibrate your defenses accordingly. They can jump over the fucking fences. Shit. <laughs> Fuck me. All right. And then what's happening here? So these guys are going to come out of this. So this is where I need, like, anti-air. They're going to be coming along this shit. So hold up. So let's make this an anti-air. Can I put down like another one, please? I'm gonna have. I'll do one in here too, I guess. I'm hoping that I can take these fucking ships out before they get to my base. I don't have to worry about it. Now I've just done everything fucking anti-air, so it's like probably not a great idea either. I don't. Maybe that'll help take out these guys that jump. Like I don't fucking know what I'm gonna do about these jumpy guys. Fuck. I guess we'll see what that's all about. Heading direct to alien base. Oh, look at these guys. That's not gonna be an anti-air thing. I need like the regular. 
Oh boy. Armor squad ready to deploy. The hit is coming. Oh, you little fucks. So basically, I just need some turrets and shit. As soon as I can get a turret in for these, I'll just put them, put them in. All the way to alien base. I'm gonna fly up here. To, I can't wait to get the thing that makes my ship like faster. That's gonna help out so much. If I ever get that. I wonder if it's like you gotta get through these missions without your base being attacked or something to get the upgrade. I don't know how you exactly get the upgrades. I really need some. It seems like my anti-air stuff has taken out those guys down there, so that's nice. Is that the jumpy dudes? Here, I'm gonna put in, here, here, here. Gunships attacking the alien. Oh, I can put another one in. Good. God damn. Oh, here they here they are. Here's the jumpy men. Like turrets and shit, though, so that's good. Oh my god! And then when it starts the new wave, they give you some extra things, right? I think the they do. The first wave of grasshoppers wasn't enough to destroy the alien core. We're opening an additional assault direction north of their base. New anti-air tanks are going to support the attack. Yeah, here, see? They fucking expanded the battle zone. That, I told you about that earlier. Here, see this shit? So, okay, these are gonna be these hoppy dudes, right? So here's what I need. I need regular ass turrets to just take care of them. Hopefully that's enough to take care of them, right? And then the problem is, then I have all this anti-air stuff going on, but they're, the anti-air is like all converging over here, so if I get, Oh, I don't have enough to upgrade that. Fuck. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take out one of these over here. I'm, I know I probably need this shit, but I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna put in this anti-air thing here. Cause that, that I really, really need right now. And then they're gonna f fly o over this, right? And there's, that's an anti-air, so I guess I could keep that, but is there any other anti-air here? There's not. So tell you what, I need to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take one of these away over, where was this, up here? This is not gonna get three, this is only gonna get two, because I want another anti-air. So they're coming down here, that's one anti-air, I want that to be anti-air too. We're gonna have that be anti-air. Then the other problem is these guys are coming along here. I think these are the hoppy guys, right? Is that the same sort of trail that these guys have? I like that the gr the line on the ground kind of shows you what the enemy is. I think I think that means those are the hoppy guys. I think. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> I think that's it. What that is, or and then. I think that means, I think those, this is just tanks, I think. I guess we're gonna find out. All right, let's start it. Tank brigade reporting, leading assault. Okay, so they're, they're up here assault. first. Attacking the aliens. So let's see. Oh, it's not. These are not the hoppy guys. God damn it. Commencing attack. Fight. Initiating air 
tell you what, there's a, yeah, there's so much air stuff going on over here. You know what? Oh, here they are. here they come, little fucks. All right, so whoa. I'm making this anti-air. I don't like to do that in the middle of the battle, but... Now, oh, fuck! Wait, oh, fuck, fuck, what? Dude, I had no idea this was going on. Oh, I'm fucking screwed. Oh my god. gonna get attacked so hard down there. Oh my god. They're circling wagons. Yeah, they're just going around kicking my ass. Oh, Alright. God damn. <laughs> well, this is all a mess. So, here... Let me fix everything. Here's what I think. The, they both converge right here. If I just have a bunch of anti-air right here, then they can't get by, and then that's taken care of. You know? There, they, they should all, all, those should all die with those, right? So now, I mean, here. So then these motherfuckers are gonna come in and like fuck my day up and I can't like make them go out this way or anything. So they're all just gonna come down here. So let's have some shit by the base that can actually like do something. Oh, fuck, I have this. Dude, I'm putting that in. Oh, look at that. That's I've never had one of those before. Oh, 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 oh. all right. And now we're going to have this. I want it even closer. I'm going to make this a... Should I have two of them? Fuck it. Let's do two of them. That takes up all my money, though. I'm going to put in just one artillery... And then, see, this side's in a lot of trouble, though. So I'm going to put down another over here. See, there's, these are, like, weak as shit. I'm going to have to, like, upgrade those. I don't know. At least I got something going on over here. I'm going to tr try to put in more things at the base. At least a lot of my resources being, are being taken up by those, but I won't have to worry about these planes at all. So everything I put down now, I'll just put down either here or here so that I can deal with this. All right, this might be better. We'll see what happens. Man. We'll see how it goes. Assault helicopters one click from alien base. Commencing attack. They call them helicopters. Those are not helicopters. Initiating air superiority mission. Assault helicopters, huh? They look like fucking jets to me. Unless they were talking about somewhere else. Alright, 
I definitely need to be able to get across this map quicker. Okay, so I can put in more shit here. So I'm gonna put in... You know what, let's do... Okay. I wanna take out these guys. Like, it's like they're already getting through here. to the other ship real quick for a minute and that fucked me up really bad. I hit the wrong button basically is what I was trying to say. Oh, that was a mess. Is that, all right, that was everybody. I don't know how much, oh, oh, now there's a, oh my God. More defensive buildings are forming a maze. Our units are being slaughtered out there. Send heavy bombers to clear a path. Fuck. Incoming heavy bombers. Ready strong anti-air defenses. Ready strong anti-air. Yeah. It's like you gotta like almost like just change your things every time. I'm like not used to that with tower defense. So I'm like always changing where I'm putting shit here. You know, all right, so these guys are still gonna come out of here. Or is there like a spot that where they're both together? Right here, boom. So this is where we need anti-air then. So I'm moving this. Nope, you can't have it there. All right, how about down, how about more like here? I don't want them to get like bombed on. So there, and what about like over here? Or, like here. All right, that's anti-air, that's anti-air. Maybe one like here. Anti-air, so, right, because they're all converging right there, I guess. I could even put in another one. I'm gonna put another one on. I'm gonna put one here. That's kind of far away though. Oh, I could put one up here? Oh shit, I didn't know I could put one up here. Oh, that's perfect. Boom, that's what you want. All right, that should fuck up their air stuff. Everything else, so these guys are gonna come down here and these guys are gonna come down here. So here's what's up. Let's do an artillery. I can only put in like one more thing. I guess I'll put in I mean, there's several things over here. I guess I'll put a, this only has three. I'll put one here. I guess. Let's upgrade it and make it. I'll do that, I guess. I guess, I don't know. Oh, those are all artillery. No, no, I mean, I have to fire one down there. And then these guys are gonna come, oh, that's coming from there and they're gonna cross that and hopefully we get taken out, so that's fine. And then I'm just double checking and then the, I'm hoping that this will take all the air out. These guys are gonna run along here. They're gonna hop over this shit, but they're still gonna have to come through here. So I should put a couple more turrets here when I'm able to basically, because there are a lot of guys are gonna be right there. Okay, I think this is pretty good. Let's do this. Level Wizard, thank you for the sub. 
Any more hack streams coming up soon? I mean, probably. Um. I, I, I have so many of those, it's just like endless, so yeah, I'm, yes, I'll, I'll do a, a hack, of, you know. I always do that shit. I kind of want to know if that's just strong enough to take it out. I'm not going to even help. Let's see if those just die and they can't get by, that's what I want to know. Like, is the guy getting through? It's like they're kind. They're like. Assault helicopters ready. On course to alien base. It's like they're almost. Can, can I change this into anti air? Here. I'm gonna put in one more anti air. Also, uh, thank you very much, Level Wizard, Level 59 Wizard. I like, I like that username. Level 59 Wizard! Um. He get that out some subs to the community. Get that out subs to DJ Star Killer Seventy Eight. Uh, to toss Tia something. I don't know how to say your name. Uh, Marco Twitch Wolf Pause and Ulav. If you guys got a gift sub from Level Fifty Nine Wizard, let them know you appreciate it. Thank you very much for the community gift sub. Appreciate that. Just ten levels away from sixty nine because he's level six, 59 wizard. Yeah, they want to know why you're not level 69 wizard so that you didn't have to hear that joke. He specifically probably thought about that. He's like, I'm going to make it level 59 wizard because I don't want to hear the 69 thing. And now from now on, I'm sorry, it just got ruined. <laughs> Thanks for the subs, though. <laughs> oh, my God. He's like, God damn it. I know. So, okay, wait, wait, wait. So these guys... Mobile anti-air entering the battle zone. Targeting alien air units. Okay, this is... I need more ground here, so... Hopefully that'll do the trick. Alright, let's go take out some of this shit over here. Another one down. I want this asshole gone. Oh, they're getting closer over here. I'll put another ground turret down. Oh shit. I should have put that over here. Fuck. Kind of blew it with that. Here. There's like so many coming. Jet fighters, ETA three seconds. Fuck your jet fighters. Here's what's gonna happen to them. Come on, bring them out. I'm ready for them. I want them. Bring them over to me. Oh, they did. Oh, they didn't even get to me because they had to get through the anti-air area. <laughs> New reinforcements are coming from the south. Now we can surround their base and attack from all directions. Fuck! Ugh, now what? strong assault force. Look out for their new anti-air tanks. They can repair other units, making our towers less effective. You should eliminate them as quickly as possible. <sighs> Alright, 
so now let's see the situation. So now the convergence point is here. You see this shit? So you know what we gotta do. You know what we gotta do. We gotta move this shit. That's what I think. Can I? Why can't I take this out? Take it out of here. There. Just give me a moment here. That's also anti-air. That's anti-air. That's anti-air. Yeah, so here's the point where we, where we want to put this shit. So, right here. We gotta have a good setup. Oh, yo, right here. What if I, what if I have two of them? Like literally right here and right here, and they're both anti-air. Like what are they gonna fucking do then? Die is what they're gonna do. I should get better anti-air stuff, is really, I'm realizing how important that is. So like boom, 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 is that enough? There should be like one more. One more. Then I don't have to worry about it. I just wanna not have to worry about it. There, that'll fuck them up, right? And then everybody else. So then there's gonna be these fucking cocksuckers coming from the bottom, right? They're gonna come up here, and I got nothing going on here. Which is a big fucking problem. But I can re-divert. Yeah, all right. Here's what I wanna do. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. And we're gonna put a fucking fence in between it. Now they have to go through this shit that I already built, which is really, really good. And then we're gonna have more things over here, like that. So they gotta make it through all this. And all I did was build a fence. And then when the guys get in here, these two are gonna be good anyway, because they're gonna try to circle my base. I wish I could like I know how what my base is at percentage-wise, because it's very fucked up. But at least, uh, <laughs> I mean, I'm alive for the moment. Do you think they're gonna make a thing where they're gonna be able to like all come down this way? Then I'll fucking build a fence across that and they won't be able to. Maybe, maybe that's what I'll do. Anyway, so like, here, I don't want this on, I want that on. Um, so they're gonna come out of here. I'm just checking everything. They're gonna all converge here, but there's a bunch of like stuff, so that should be all right. I mean, I should I need to put more down, but um, that anti-air shit needs to be there. What about what's going on up here? I got a couple guys here. I don't know if I care about those being there anymore. I'm gonna take these out. I mean, it doesn't hurt, but so. What I could do is kind of have them closer to here. Then I kind of know what's going on better. I'm gonna put those back, but I'm gonna put them here. I'm gonna put it here and here. Then I won't forget about those up there. What's going on up here? Okay, oh, that's right. This is all just my anti-air stuff. Okay, I think this is pretty prepared, I think. What about this path? These guys are gonna come over here, they're gonna come down here, and they still have to go through this shit, which I want more stuff here, but that's what I got for now. All right, I think this is pretty set up, let's go. JJ12, thanks for the sub, and I take the square. Thank you as well, guys. Does your base repair itself? I think eventually you get something that does that maybe, but I don't think I have that yet. So I don't think it's repairing itself yet, but later in the game, maybe it does that. I don't, I don't know yet about that. I was, I'm wondering that myself. We will find out eventually. Here, how's this going over here? Let's check. Assault helicopters one click away from the other place. Commencing attack.
and put more shit down. Good luck getting through that. I mean... Oh, I was supposed to put more shit over here. Fuck, I forgot. Alright, I'm gonna do that. Fuck, fuck. Shit, they're getting in. Air support, no location, one minute. Air support experiencing heavy losses. Fuck. Definitely like a base repair thing. That would be like probably the best thing I could have at this point. If I got some kind of upgrade like that. Jet Parker's ETA, three seconds. Oh, it's more of them? Fucking running for me. The X Morph are fending off all our attacks one by one, as if they knew how we were going to hit them. Thank you, Nanu410, for that sub. Brute force. All remaining units, prepare for the final assault. Do we know how long until the end of the wave? Uh, that's a good question. Like how long the wave lasts? I don't know that. the final attack wave. Anticipate strong ground attacks from all directions, as well as heavy bomber and jumping unit attacks. All right. As usual, let's see where. They're all coming together. Do I have to move this again? All right, so this is flying down here. Like, basically right into my... Ugh. Hold on, hold on. I, I might have a lot I have to do here. <sighs> okay, so... This is the bomber, right? It's gonna fly straight fucking down. <laughs> but you know what? There's not another plane thing coming in at all. That's the only one. So that means I should take out some of these anti-airs. Which there's probably quite a few around, right? So let's, like these are not going to do shit right now. So those shouldn't even fucking be here. Which is great because this is going to give me plenty of stuff to use. What else is anti-air? I'm starting to learn these icons. I wanted like text before, and I kind of still think there should be text, but the fact that there's the, I, I mean, I'm, now I'm starting to learn the icons a little bit, but it would kind of be nice if it had kind of both, maybe, I don't know. Um, anyway, so I need this shit to be taken down. So if I put one here, are they gonna bomb that? No, they're not. So he's gonna become anti-air. That's good. We're gonna have another one here. It's like I wanna get it as close as I can without them being in, in the range to be able to get me. So that's two. What about here? That's three. Usually, I feel like it's four. One, two, three. about like, oh, it's cutting it close, but how about here? That's four, that's four anti-airs. Right, so hopefully that's enough. Now, everybody else is gonna come in. Now they're all coming down here. This area is like the, the big fucking battle zone here. And then they're all coming through. They, either they have to come through there or there, that's got a lot already. I feel like this could be beefed up a bit. So I'm gonna put in some more shit here. Let's have something here. I'm gonna actually just like try to upgrade this to something more interesting. Let's have like another one of these fire artillery guys. I mean, that's pretty sweet. And then 
What about like? How about this is, becomes just like the middle range artillery? And let's have another one of those, like maybe like well, I'll, I'll make this one a, mi a middle range artillery too. Right, so there you go. And then I got two more still to do. So let's look at this area. I mean, this has a lot, but wouldn't hurt if I had one. I'm gonna put one here. They're gonna get into the, well, the, I guess the goal is to not let them get into the base. I'm gonna put one here and then I'm gonna upgrade it. I wish I could upgrade it to another one of those fire ones, but I don't have enough. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it that. All right. Pretty good, I guess. Let's start it. See how this goes. What do I think about this game so far? I, I like it a lot. I don't really have too many complaints yet. Especially like a lot of the little teeny things that I'm wondering about. It's just like I might just not understand. I, there's like a lot I don't understand yet. So I don't really have any complaints at all yet. I may eventually, but... Man, they like fucked me up. safe here. Never say that, though. This guy's coming from behind. Yeah, fuck you. I'll, I'll fucking come up from behind and get him. Alright, that's that side. Let's go get these guys. I think I arranged this, like, pretty damn well this time. not a lot they can do. I, I have a much better arrangement than I've been having. I haven't been doing too well. I mean, I'm learning the game. I feel like this this one's going better, but who knows what'll happen. The aliens have won. This oh, it's over? It's completely saturated with X-Morph structures. We won't be able to win it back. You're damn right you won't. Get the fuck out of town. Another harvester core secured. Humans have been cut off from resource deposits. Our consciousnesses will be grateful to you for assimilating this planet. Assimilating? To the next region. Your biological and technological distinctiveness will become our own. Your culture will adapt to service us. Resistance is futile. Bah ha ha. Okay, so there we go. We beat that area. Yo, this game's awesome. <laughs> I like this game a lot. This is fucking good. Listen, sometimes I gotta play um, games that like I really like in between like playing Pest Terminator. And, uh, you know, shit like that. So, anyway, I'm going to take a quick break for a few minutes. I'll come back, and then we'll, we'll, we'll play some more. Uh, I'll be back in a few minutes. Maybe. Maybe if I can get the button to do what I want it to do. The button? If I can make the button go to the break. All right, I'll be right back.
All right, guys, I'm back. I'm playing X Morph Defense. This is uh, on PC. I got it on Steam, and uh, I just took a break. I was uh, busy slamming my cock and balls in the kitchen drawer over and over. So now that I'm done doing this, once in a while I gotta like defuse a bit and do that. But now I'm back and I'm ready to go for another round. Thank you, uh, social media. Appreciate that. You just got done watching Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1990 again for the 800th millionth time. That's a lot to watch a movie, but you know what? If you're gonna pick a movie to watch that many times, that's a good one to watch. It's a good movie. Your points were you is uh, Z deck. Were you going for how long the break was? Were you doing one of those? Zanato says thank you. I just won seventy three thousand points. How are you winning that? Is there somebody organizing that? It's a comfort movie for sure. That's a great movie. What's it about? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from 1990? Oh, okay, thank you, Tanuki Jumpman, I was wondering. Um, well, in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from 1990, um, you see there are these turtles, and they live in the sewer, and there is, uh, they're, they're just living their life, but there's, there's crime. There's crime afoot. And boy, when I say afoot, I, I mean it, because the, the bad guy in the movie, Shredder, has an army of foot soldiers, and they have to stop not only the foot soldiers, but Shredder as well. But that's okay, because... Their sensei, Master Splinter, who is a rat, have taught them the ways of being uh, superheroes or whatever. So yeah, check it out. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, 1990. <laughs> I, le I like giving the plot to old movies. You can so there's a thing, it's the, called uh, the internet. Do you know about that internet thing? And you can like, so what you can do is you can type and you could, you could type in, like, the name of the movie and then hit enter. And what will happen is information about it will come up and you'd be able to, like, read about that yourself. But, I mean, you can also come here and get that information from me, too, I guess. And now the plot for Uncle Buck. Oh, my God. You know, I saw that in the theater. Oh, my God. Um... You know what one I really like? I like planes, trains, and automobiles. Um, and uh, old SCTV and all that. I watch some SCTV. Hit enter and you will get a huge PP. But what if you already had that? Then what? Then what? I was born in 1986, so I was turtle crazy. If you don't know, then I'm sorry. See, well, that's interesting to me because I was born in 80, and then Turtles came out in 87. So you would have been one year old when Turtles came out. See, I remember when the original cartoon aired in 1987. So I was, see, I think, I feel like, I feel like that's a little late. I mean, I'm glad that you are still into Ninja Turtles, but I would think that you would have been more into something that would have come out in, like, you know, like, 95 or something, because, like, you were only, like, one or two when the turtle craze was going on. So, I, right, you know? Because that was, like, 80... So the turtle thing was, like, 87, 88, 89, 90. I feel like, but... Because by the time... Like, after the second movie was over, I feel, is where it started to die down. By the time the third movie came out, 
I was like, I was done, at, like with turtle stuff for a while. I mean, I, listen, I always loved turtle. I loved turtles my whole life, but like the craze of turtles, I feel like. What what year was that third movie? Um, let's see. And I'll get back to this game in a second. That was 1993. So I was into it right from the start in. It was 87, I think, um, when the cartoon started. And then, yeah, by 93, I remember already being done with Turtles and, like, on to other things by 93. So I feel like 92, like, like 87 to, like, 91, 92 is, like, when I, like, I would think was would be the height of that. Um, no, I mean, and listen, like, Turtles are, like, always popular, but I feel like when that third movie came out, it was, like, kind of, like, in decline a bit. But then they had the new shows come out, which was, that new show came out, like, later, and then sort of, it gradually started to, like, get, like, reinvigorated, but, um, for a while, I think their popularity kind of, like, waned for a bit. But the, um... See, I wrote a whole video on it. We did a cartoon series review, and I watched all the episodes. So, yeah, 1987. It was the end of 87. It was actually more like 88, wasn't it? So, like, 88. I mean, it was technically 87. So, like, like 1988, it's like they had the original five-part episode, which is sort of like its own, like, sort of mini-movie. And, uh... I remember watching that. I remember watching the. I also remember watching the when Ducktales originally aired, and it was Treasure of the Golden Suns was the first five part. That's what they used to do, I guess, for a while back then. And in, in that era, they would have these like five part cartoon things to like launch a series. Um. But yeah, so it would have been like eighty eight, eighty nine, ninety, ninety one. That's like when I was really into Turtles. Um. But anyway, but like I said, I love Turtles my whole life, but third movie was 1993. Turtles was still being in 91, 92. You remember seeing the second and third movies in the theater? I saw I saw all three of them in the theater. Um, I just remember, but I remember when the third one came out it was kind of like I would see the ads on TV and it, look, it was like, eh. It, like, didn't look at the ads, like, didn't look as good, but I was like, I guess I'll go see it anyway, but I was kind of like, I didn't really want to anymore. It's kind of like, I'll, I, I think it felt, like, obligated because I was a Turtle fan. I was like, all right, I guess let's see it. But I had already also stopped watching the cartoon because I feel like by, like, season... I didn't l like when they changed it later on with the original Turtle series, like... You, you know how the turtles, like, looked, in, like, originally? Like, they changed the design of the turtles at a certain point. It might have been, I don't know, by, like, season maybe six or something like that. They start, they changed how they looked and all that. I didn't like any of that. I didn't like when they started, like, changing it, you know? But I was already out of it before then. I think I, I would, I think I watched turtles from, like, season one to season, like, Four and then season four to five of Turtles, I, I like started to fall off, and I was really feeling like all even at, back then as a kid, like I was feeling like all the plots were the same and it wasn't really going anywhere. Because I was because I, I remember back then, like as a kid, everybody's like, oh, there's the Technodrome. Oh, where's the Technodrome now? It's like stuck in the lava now. Oh, they're under the ice or whatever, and it just kind of got like they didn't go anywhere with it. Where early on you were like, um, you didn't know where it was gonna go, but then they just kept like, see, because the show goes on for 10 fucking seasons and it's like, all right, you know, it, the Technodrome's underground and now it's like in Dimension X and now it's in the, I think it's in the ice for a while, right? And then it's like in the lava and you're just like, when is something gonna happen? <laughs> like, I don't know, that's how I felt. So that's why I think I gave up on it because of that. It was just like it didn't go anywhere. And I still feel that way. And even like, so I watched all the episodes. I watched all 10 seasons for that cartoon series review and then did all the notes and everything. And by the end of it, like, I think like the Technodrome is like, you see like, 
you see you see the technodrome in, in I think the like the last episode like briefly and it's just like it's like wherever in Dimension X or something and like I don't know I, I don't know I was very very into it but like I definitely fell off like the second half of the series was just like not nearly as interesting I liked like the first like couple two three seasons and then I'm like good after that that's all I need unfortunately but the, the movie's great though the, the first movie I love the first movie anyway you really got me fucking going on Ninja Turtles so sorry I'm gonna get back to this um all right, so we're playing. So I don't know if I should go back and like do the earlier missions now, and like would I get like a better like rating? Hang on a second. So okay, I have an upgrade for one thing. Okay, so spaceship repair or faster movement. I think I want the faster movement more than I um, I'm gonna get the faster movement. What's this? Ooh. There's a core weapon? What's this? Oh, and you can make the fence longer too. Wow, there's so many cool things here. Well, for now, I'm getting the speed. Um, so I have three of these tech things I can do. Yeah, so I tend to use these air defense things a lot. So I'm going to do the, the missile tower. I have one left I can do. I'm going to take... Well, I guess I'm taking a laser beam because that's like all I can do now. Or wait, I could no, I should save the money and then I could put it into getting one of these next time. I'm gonna save that one. So this is the first mission. I guess I'm gonna do it again and see if I do it better, if it earns me anything. And you guys haven't seen the first one, so let's just redo that. Do you want to proceed? I do want to proceed. Yeah. That's the problem with 99% of the 80s and 90s cartoons you try to rewatch. They don't go anywhere. Yeah. It's, it's true. Uh, yeah. Harvest your entry in the atmosphere. Prepare for That's why I was always more into, like, the old shorts. Like old, old like uh, old like Disney shorts or like uh, Looney Tunes shorts, because it's just like then it's just like a six minute cartoon or Tom and Jerry or stuff like that, and it's just like you get all the entertainment you need in one cartoon, you know, and then it's over, and it's like that was the plot for that, and it's good, you know, and and that's that kind of where these cartoons just go on forever and ever, like nothing ever like happens. So I, I'm, I, I've always been like that. I'm more of a fan of just like old like cartoon shorts and like these series that go on and don't go anywhere. This thing is flying too close to our core. Drive it away. The aliens are shooting at us. Call the army. This is when this is when you first like. So this is the first map mission, and it's just like you know, here are the humans, and they're like trying to. It's like the cops come, and the the the, the cops are gonna take down this, <laughs> like. And then you're just like, it's just like cars come. It's like a guy in a pickup truck is like the guy in the pickup truck is gonna come and like take it. Take this fucking thing down. Yeah. Okay. Good luck on that. How do I feel about Flash Gordon? I mean, I love the old. Uh, you're gonna get me going on Flash Gordon. Um, I like the old comic books, like the original um, comics are like be are like beautiful. The Alex Raymond stuff. Um, that's probably my favorite thing about Flash Gordon is just like the the early original comics and how nice the art is. Um, 
I, I, w I used to watch the, you know, as a kid, I'd watch like film serials and I would see the Flash Gordon film serials. And they're, you know, um, I'm sort of nostalgic for those, but they're fine. They, they are what they are, you know. Um, they were probably exciting for kids back then in like the 30s or whatever, but. Um, but I like that old film serial stuff. It's 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 cool for a little bit. Uh, but and then there's the movie. There's the Flash Gordon movie. I used to watch that with James all the time in college. The the old uh, the, like the 1980 whatever it is Flash Gordon movie. Uh, it's entertaining, but. Um, the thing I like legitimately like about Flash Gordon is, is the is the original like comics, really. Um, there's like video games. I think there's like an Atari game or something, and then th those aren't very good or anything. Um, so yeah, I don't even have the ability yet to put in the turrets or anything. Maybe this was too early of a mission for me to do. But whatever. I think if I do this though, I'll be able to show you the spider fight. This might have been not the thing to do. Maybe I should not do this. <laughs> the invaders destroyed all of our reconnaissance forces with ease. We have to stop them before they destroy the whole city. I guess I'm into it. I guess I'll just go through it. Ground strike force. The reason I'm doing it, though, is I'm hoping that I can get, like, more upgrades and shit, but I'd probably be better to get upgrades if I do, like, the newer missions. You know what? I think I'm going to just... So, that, that, I don't know. That's the, that's the first um, mission. I, I've done it already. I, I, I don't know if I'm going to get, like, more points or anything if I do that. I'm going to actually not, not do that. I decided... I'm just gonna exit this. Let's just go to the next mission. Batman 1966. What about Batman 1966? Um, here, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna save this, still save the technology. Do I like it? Do I like Batman 1966? Yeah, of course I like Batman 1966. You have you have not selected all the technologies that are required to start this mission. Okay, what do you want me to buy? Oh. Is it this? I have this. What do I need this? Wait. What if I take that off and get that? Why is it giving me an exclamation point on this? I have it. I don't know what it is they want me to do to start this. It's not even telling me like what I'm supposed to do. I mean, it has the exclamation point, but it's like, I had it, I bought it, so what's the problem? Recommended. Okay, well, I had it on. <laughs> like, right? There, I have it. You know? So, go. You have not selected technology that required to start the mission. Does anybody understand this? It's like, also, why are they saying that that's locked? That's just the turret stuff. Like, right? Like, why is it locked like that? I don't get why it has a lock on it. Back up off screen and look at the requirements. It doesn't say anything about requirements here. the fuck? What if I buy, put on this? No, I have that right. What if I, can I buy that? No, it's locked. I don't understand what the fuck they want me to do to start this fucking mission. Maybe you have to have both of these. 
Now what? Now can I go? You still have a technology. Oh, maybe that was the problem. Maybe they want you to have all of that. You still have a technology. Do you want to proceed? I do want to proceed. That's why. You have to have all of it. Why don't they tell you that? <laughs> it just has an exclamation. It should have an exclamation point on all three of them, then. All three of the air things, because, like, it had it on the first one, on the top one. And I'm like, okay, well, I have it. They should have a green exclamation point on the bottom, too, as well. Because, like, I'm like, anyway, I got lucky and figured it out. <laughs> Zelda 2 top pack looks good for this time of year. Oh, Winter Solstice? I did, well, I did Winter Solstice. I beat it. Uh, Gape Fist McFarter. Hey, hey. So, listen. Hang on. Gape Fist McFarter. Maybe you don't... Winter Solstice ROM hack. Excuse me. I want you to listen to me. This is specifically for you. Gape Fist McFarter. He's recommending that I play Zelda 2 Winter Solstice. I already did win Zelda 2 Winter Solstice. If you go on YouTube, you can look up that playthrough. I played through the whole game and I beat it. Ah, uh, damn, I need to check it out. Yeah. I did. It, so it's on YouTube. When, do Mike Matei, Zelda 2, Winter Solstice. You'll find it. I went through the whole game. I did it probably a year or two ago. Probably like two years ago or something. It was Or something like that. A year and a half ago. It was a while ago. So, yeah, go check that out. It's a very good uh, game. You you probably I, that was a pretty decent stream. So you might it's lo, it's a very long stream and I think it's in two parts. But check that out. It's on my channel. Thank you very. I just wanted to clear that up because I feel um, very uh, deeply about um, not only like Zelda two and Zelda two ROM hacks, but I feel very deeply about. Um, making sure that Gape Fist McFarter is satisfied um, with my responses and satisfied with uh, just everything. I want you to be, I want Gape Fist McFarter to be happy. That's what's important to me. So thank you very much, Gape Fist McFarter, for the question, and I hope that you appreciate. Uh, the answer, and I think you're Gape Fist McFarter. I think you're gonna really like that stream. In fact, we got a link there from Brisby. Thank you, Brisby, for linking that to Gape Fist McFarter. Okay, now I can move on. I just wanted to say that as many times as humanly possible. All right. General, we've targeted an export core. The aliens are invading Russia sooner than we expected. Mike is so thoughtful and cur and courteous. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know what? Um, I think Gape Fist McFarter deserves it. Don't you? <laughs> no, in all seriousness, though, I did play that, and that, that's a cool hack. So yeah, check out the stream. The exports are extremely dangerous. We have to scout their base before the main assault. Infantry should be able to sneak up to their core without being noticed. We'll hide in the forest and surprise them from the flank. Go, go, go! Warning. Incoming surprise attack. We are placing a flavor tower to protect the core. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, this game's awesome. So, when Elmo plays this game, oh, by the way, if you wanted to know, um, Elmo to Elmo recommended this game to me. He told me that he 
he's like fine with the game or whatever. He he likes the idea of global world domination. So that's what he likes about the game. But when he when he does runs of the game, he he is really into the flamethrower weapons, and he gets all the flame upgrades, and he just makes it so the whole earth is all like in fire. So he goes, you know, he goes to the different areas, and he's like, all right, everything has to be flamethrowers. It's pretty it's pretty entertaining to watch Elmo play this. It's just he makes it all just like, did you see that one flamethrower that there was? Everything is just a flamethrower when he plays. It's crazy. He's 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 really he's actually really good at this game. So I just wanted to just throw out there, um, you know, thanks to Elmo for recommending me this game. Um, and I'll one day I'll probably never he put he's put so many hours into this, but um, one day maybe I'll be able to put down that many flamethrowers myself. I I hope to one day be as Talented as Elmo at this. Thank you, Elmo. Look, see right here. This is like an Elmo situation right over here. <laughs> anyway, all right. Um, so, all right. These guys are gonna come out from here. Okay, wait. These are coming through the forest. This is interesting. Um, Huh. All right. Uh, hang on. I'm just trying to decide how I'm going to exactly do this. Um, Put this fence on. They can still get through. Oh, fucking line it up. There we go. Oh, the foot guys can still get through. Really? They can just go through. Oh, those are the guys that can hop over shit. Forgot about them. That did make a bunch of them. Fuck, they can all just hop right over that. Oh. Um, hang on a second. Do this instead. Can I let? Oh, God damn it! Let's try, well, I gotta put it here, here, and then here. Maybe that will be better. And then. I mean, this is a little better. Let's put one there to there, and oh shit, and connect those. Okay, that's a little better. You know what? If I do, will I be able to do this? Let's see. Will. There we go. That's what I want to happen. Okay, now that I got that straightened out, um, let's make this whole area crazy. These fucking guys I'm worried about, they're gonna come out of here and be a problem. So, like, well, the flame thing is there. Yeah, what if I put another flame one down? Can I do that? I can. Let's do let's do this shit. Fuck it. Oh, 
fuck yeah. Oh, maybe this is gonna be, maybe it's gonna be Elmo time right now. Maybe it's gonna be Elmo time right now! Maybe Elmo time! That's my impression of him. It's done out of love. I, I, don't take offense, Elmo. It's only, it's only done out of love. That's just a little impression that I do of Elmo. Elmo is real, though. Just so you know. Some people, some, somebody wrote me an email and they said, Hey, Mike, you know Elmo's um, a puppet, right? And I said, I said to them, I said, I said to them, I said, I said, hey, fuck you. That's what I, that's what I said to him. You know what? I'm gonna, I need something over there, so hold up. And I wasn't thinking about all this, so let's have at least something here. All right, I'm gonna try that. Let's see how this goes. I don't know. I don't know. Infantry joining the battle. Air support attacking aliens. Oh, look at this fucking thing. Shit. Oh my god. I haven't seen that before. What the fuck? Man, I'm gonna need some, definitely need some of the air defense things. Oh shit, they're in already. Ah. Okay. <laughs> oh shit, what have I done? Mobile AA support units prepare to fight. Initiating air superiority mission. This is rough. Dude, this fucking guy is strong as shit. Jeez. Of shit. Fuck! They're in? Mm. God. The attack from the forest hasn't succeeded. I'm sending in armored personnel carriers to pave the way and shield the infantry. I'm gonna lose this. <laughs> Your video of Mario was great. Which video of Mario? I've done about a hundred and ninety thousand videos of Mario. We, oh, I did uh, the the Mario three mix. Jumping the flagpole. Uh, <laughs> I, I like a hundred million videos on Mario. So they want the flamethrowers and shit. Yeah, what if I just make this whole forest go on fire here? That's what I want to do. Fire, fire, fire. Like that. And I, dude, I need air defense. Everything here looks like it's going to be ground, though, doesn't it? So, like, here, what if I put... I'm gonna put another flamethrower thing here. Oh, I probably can't even. Can I? Yeah, I can. All right, it's another flamethrower thing, I guess. We'll see how it goes. Mario is the landlord. Oh, that. The alternate history thing, thanks. Uh, I mean, I don't know, I did that. Like, that, So that video came out 20 years ago, or I made that video 20 years ago. But yeah, so um, I found a VHS tape um, of it, and then I saw online 
that video had been online for a long time, so I put that on there a long time ago, because that's like the second video I ever made with James. So it was in really kind of bad quality. It was 360p, which is pretty bad. So I took it from the VHS tape, and then I... So now it's like 1080p. It's still a VHS transfer of it, but at least now it's 1080p. So that's why I was like, all right, well, this could be in better quality. Anyway, all right, I'm going to start this. Thank you, uh, Foe Sheezy, for the tier one sub. So there is all kinds of like air shit that I should be having in here. Good, fuck the air support. Wow, they're already fucking this up, huh? Guess the flamethrower thing isn't really helping. Oh god, and they're coming from the bot. Like, what? Fucking hell. I fucked this up. Alright, fuck. I'm gonna load the checkpoint. That, that's like fucked. <sighs> the Mario video with the thing and the stuff, that one was great. Oh, yeah, the oh god, the one that has the thing and the stuff. You mean the 12. Um, orbs, Mario's 12 orbs, that, that's the one I think he means. I'm pretty sure that's the exact one you're talking about. So yeah, these guys come out here, they're, they can just jump through my fences, so like, what I should do then is I should make this go down. Here, wait. Here's what I'm gonna do. Is that the best spot I could have put that in? I'm gonna put this here, and then. Oh. oh god, there's not even more to build? What the hell is going on? Hang on. I'm gonna take this away. So that, for, for one thing, that's gonna help. Now, um, you know what, since all these guys are like, gonna converge down there, I'm gonna put this shit down here instead, I think. So, there's nothing I can do about this, so like, I don't know about the flamethrower thing either. Like, it doesn't seem like it's working that great. Then again, if I, I'm gonna put one right here, actually. Let's do that. That can do the flamethrower from both sides. This has this, let's make this a, oh, I don't even have the artillery thing, wow. Fuck. Um, damn. Ugh. I definitely do think I'm going to need an anti-air thing. There was, like, air guys, so, like, I'm going to put one here. Oh, I can't even make it anti-air. I don't have enough. Fucking hell. Mm. You know what? Is this thing helping me out much? Why don't I get rid of that one? That's the one the game, like, put down. I don't even want those. I want an anti... I'm setting this up the way I want. I want this shit. I want that shit. Oh, look at that. I haven't even seen that before. Yeah, I want that. Okay. That's cool. And then all these fucks are over here, so like, I'm gonna just put another like regular thing. Here, let's have one like here. I guess. 
No, I'll put it here. There. This should be better. We'll see. I'm like hanging out by this like uh, air def air turret thing to help me out. All right, I want another one down. Ship health. The, the ship does repair itself fairly quick, so that's nice. Just save it, I guess. All right, wave three is seven. Okay, now. Reinforcements coming in from the refinery. I'm opening a new attack on the alien base from the south. Yeah. So. I know they are. I'm fucking aware. So, I can't stop the foot guys from coming. So, like. I'm going to block this off now. So we're gonna do like that, and then how far over can this go? To there, and then hopefully this makes them, oh, there's still foot guys there. Fuck. I didn't realize that. Um, God. <laughs> Fuck me. All right, well. God, this is rough. Well, I feel like a lot of these guys are getting in here too, so let's have like that. Let's have another one here. I can't put in, um, and I know, I know like the fire is like supposed to be good against them. I guess I'll make some of them fire. That's what the game's like telling me to do, so I guess I should listen, right, to some extent. I'll make this one fire. That's what it seems to want me to do. I mean, that's fire, that's a foot guy. That's fire, that's a foot guy. That's fire, that's a foot. I mean, what the fuck else can I do? Romeo, Tango, Zulu. Prepare for the next wave. You're clear to engage. A hunk of hunk of burning love. Uh, just a hunk of hunk of burning love. Team engaging hostile. Lord Almighty, I feel my temperature rising. That's good for the flamethrowers. Higher and higher, it's burning through to my soul. Here come the fucking these guys. Uh oh. Yeah, the flamethrower does do pretty well there. Yo, okay, hold up. Anti air. Well, when I'm able to, I'll put in another anti air, I guess. Can't do it yet. Actually, honestly, the fire does do pretty well, doesn't it? Okay, now I want an anti-air. Let's make... 
This thing. An air guy. You know, I, I'm not gonna get a chance to like put any fucking anything down, huh? Here, fuck you. Can I please? Oh no. It's like the problem is I don't have the time to. Oh god. Jeez. The aliens are decimating our units on the ground. We have to intensify airborne attacks. Prepare heavy assault helicopters to attack in the next wave. Okay. Warning. Incoming large flying enemy. Oh my god. Prepare strong anti air defenses. Okay. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, yes, Galvatron. Whatever you say, Lord Galvatron, I will do what you want me to do. <laughs> Anything you fucking say, my lord. All right. Um, you know, these guys are coming from up here, right? So fuck you. Like, all right, there's some air defense shit. So, like... Where's the feet coming from? <laughs> the feet are coming from there. That's the only feet I say is down there, right? Any feet coming from there? Seems like only the bottom, right? So it's almost like... <sighs> I wanna see something. If I, like, I wanna change this up. Let's say I put this here, and I put it here. Can I? Okay, I can divert that and make them go around. That maybe gives me a little extra time, but the, so the f foot soldier guys are still coming here, but that's all right, because I could put in another flamethrower thing. I want to put this flamethrower thing closer. I want to put it like here. Right? So those guys get burned earlier. They don't get close to there. Um, this is a mess over here. Is what this is. <laughs> this is a fucking mess. I want to think about what I'm doing more. I don't even... I don't like this situation at all. I don't like... I feel like I'm not thinking about what I'm doing. I'm taking... I'm just taking a bunch of things away. And I'm going to rethink this situation. So... Those two things are probably not enough to take this all out, you know? Also, this, I feel like this sucks over here, too. So I need another one. So here's this. I want another anti-air thing. It's going to go here. Oh, I like how the truck just gets, like, destroyed. How about, how about this? 
Right, that's another anti-air. Ooh, look at that shit. I like that. That's awesome. So now we have all these anti-air things. Should I put in another one or what? I don't know about that. So they're going to come out of here. They're going to come down here. These guys will get diverted. This is not a foot thing. So they're going to have to come here. I almost wonder... Wait a second. I'm stupid. Let's see. This is why I'm doing this. You don't want this. You want it, you want it over here because you want them to come down. Or even better, if I can get them to come over here. Hang on a second. Hold up. Hold up. What would happen if I... I wish I could, like, spin this a little bit. I'm going to put one here. I'm going to put one here. There. Ooh. So now they're going to come down this way. That's converging together. Can I get them to come down here? Yeah, I could block this all, the shit off. Dude, check this out. Dude, they can suck my dick. Now we're fucking talking. Now we're fucking talking. Now they all have to come here into this. So now what you want is you want to just build up this fucking area down here. So we're going to have... Everybody has... So I'm going to put this here. This here. This here. This is better. Now what's going on up here? It's a flamethrower thing. See, but there's no foot guys coming down there, right? I mean there might be eventually. I don't think this I don't think that these are great for anything other than the foot guys. So I don't think I need two of those. Personally. And this shit, the way I have this blocked off, I mean, that might actually be good. I did that in the beginning, and that is prevent that is making it so they can only go there. So that might be good. So what I'm going to do, then, is I'm going to have these guys get wrecked, like, there and there. It's just like, they come over here, and they're going to get the fuck shot out of them. Okay. This is better. This is better. Now let's do this. This game looks fun. It's, 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 I like it. It's probably not for everybody, but I like this kind of shit. Boom. Alright, let's see how this goes. going on up here. Uh-oh. Okay, this is a problem. Shit, 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 shit. was bad. I can't be let, having them get in here. Fuck. Oh my god, look at this. Heavy column destroyed. We're losing oh this. Oh boy. They're 
they're losing it, I feel like I'm losing it. I'm missing like every damn shot. Oh my god, oh my god. Fuck me, 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 fuck me. Oh my god, I just like died. It, it brings you back in a second. Oh my god, oh my god. So your like ship can die, but then they bring you back. It, it, it's like a penalty of a couple, five seconds or something until they bring you back if you die. So I mean, it'll, it'll like respawn you, but. get them all? Like, I don't even know. There's, like, a, still somebody in here or something. What? What? Am I still being attacked? The hell was that? Even the heavy assault helicopters can't break through the alien defenses. However, I just received information from the Russians that their prototyping chronoplan gunship is already on the way. We have to slow down the X-Morph expansion for a bit longer. I'm opening a new attack front from the north of the X-Morph core. Oh, God. <laughs> Warning. Human attacks are incoming from a new direction. Prepare yourself. Oh, dude, I don't know. I'm. This is getting hard. Um... This is fucking stressful. All right, so like, okay, all this shit is gonna come down here. Oh, yo. I'm making some bad mistakes here. So you know what? Oh, God damn it. Can I move? Wait. Oh, this lets you move it, like, right over, huh? But I gotta connect. Wait, what the fuck? The, it's, like, going into the wall? Hang on a second. Oh, maybe I moved it far enough away that I can't, yeah, I couldn't reach anymore. Okay. There. Now. Sorry, I have, like, a lot that I'm gonna have to fucking change here. Oh. This, it's just a mess. Also, like, each round, they change things. So, like, okay, there to there. Then I want... Let's say, like, here. Right, there we go. Okay. At least they're gonna be getting shot along that way. That's better. Um, how's this going with the anti-air stuff though? So, that's an anti-air, that's an anti-air, that's an anti-air. That's three anti-airs. I feel like there could be one more. I'm gonna put in one more. Like here. Oh fuck! This is also. 
Uh oh. Wait, these converge, right? Oh, do they? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, they don't really. Wait, where is this going? Wait a second, what? Does it just turn in here at that point? Why does it like this? Why does this line like disappear? I'm assuming that it turns like in here? I don't really. Or are they like dropping shit off? I don't really understand that. Here, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna put. I guess I'm gonna put an anti air here. I don't really know. And that kind of helps take care of that, but they need to get fucked up along the way. So they're coming out of this and they need to be getting hit. So like, I'm gonna have to put another one in. I'm gonna put in, I guess I could put in something really crazy strong and hopefully that fucking takes care of them. That takes care of those. Maybe. All right, so I gotta like really look at everything. Um, these guys are coming out of here. It's some anti-air shit, but there's not, they're not really getting attacked by much. Like, that's great. This guy, this, these guys have a direct path basically to walk right in, you know, and just completely just fucking destroy me is how that's going right at this moment. <laughs> so like, I, I need to be able to fix that. I'll put something over there in a minute, maybe. All right, so these, like, these guys that can just, like, walk in, that can't be allowed to happen. So I need a flamethrower here. You know? So let's have that. Should kill them pretty well. Now let's see what else we got going on. This is very complicated now. So we got this way, that's like regular enemies. This way is like regular, like tanks and whatever. So they they have to come through all this shit. So that's pretty well protected. I can't complain there. Like, I don't think there's the foot guys coming here, so I'm gonna take that away. And... Like... I hate how they can just like get in. Basically they all, this should be, this shit should just be surrounded. Like boom, boom, boom. They, they have to go through that at least, right? Like everybody's gotta go through that so they'll get hurt. I guess I'm gonna try it. I mean, it's a better setup than it was. I don't know. I'm gonna try it. Armor transport's on the spot. Get our boys as close to the alien core as possible. Air support, engaging hostiles. I'm, I'm always looking at that. That mini map is like really well done in this game. It's very easy to understand. And I'm always looking at the mini map to see like where things are like coming from and everything. So like that's like it really really is well done. for them to go to to get down there. They expanded this map out. Heavy helicopters entering battle zone. Targeting alien core. Over. Thank Brigade reporting. Leading assault. Oh yeah, here comes these and they're are they getting destroyed down here? Thanks for joining the attack. They're they're getting destroyed. I think. <laughs> I don't think they can make it. I definitely want to be able to get the thing to get around this map quicker. Or did I take that? Or I might, actually, maybe I took that already. Oh fuck. Okay.
Come on. And all this shit get in here. Oh my god. Air support ready. We push it back. Over. Fucking hell. Um, fuck. Well, I thought I had. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, <laughs> it's over. What? This isn't even close. I died, huh? Oh, God, fuck. What was I supposed to even do? <sighs> Yay, Earth. <laughs> right? Oh, good job, Earth. They fucked me up. I'm not even sure. Yeah, I'm the alien Tanuki Jump Man. Like just like regular turrets, you think? Like, uh, do they keep this set up to? Oh, they. Oh, that's smart. They don't like revert you back. That's like the last. That's the way you. Ha I had it before I started the wave. I guess that's really smart that they do that. So I don't have to like redo all that that I did. Well, that I really like. So anyway, also like, wait a second. What am I doing? I gotta get this to, you know why? Cause earlier there was the, uh, the foot guys, but now there's not right here. So I have to get this to go together. Hold up. We're gonna block this off. I didn't realize this. I mean, that's one major fucking problem right there. There we go. All right, well, that's gonna help. Can I get like, can I get it even more? Well, they're all kind of converging right there. I mean, that's great. Hang on a second. Hold up. It's just these fucking foot guys. Well, you know what? I could put in like one fucking, one more flamethrower. Then I don't have to fucking worry about the fucking foot guys at all. There. There's two fucking flamethrower things. That should take care of the foot dudes. So like, and then all the, the problem is all of these guys are gonna come. Do I even need an anti-air right there? I'm gonna take that out too. Cause like, this is coming around here. I got one, two, they should already be dead by the time they come over here. And that's also anti-air. That, that shouldn't even make it there. I shouldn't have to worry about any of those. So what I have to worry about though is this area. All right. So like, this shit has to be strong as fuck. And like, yeah, there's like a million tanks. So yeah, like, Also, there's a million tanks coming in this direction, too, which is a major fucking problem. So that's got to be, like, straightened out, too. Ugh. 
I, I now I have like nothing around my base, but like this is a little better. I mean, this is this down here is okay, but the, my real problem is that like this is the only defense for all this. It, they, I need like more shit here. I wish I had, if I had a little more money, I could put a bunch of shit there, and then I then I might be all right. And these guys come down from here too. I need like, yeah, I need more. I need a bunch of, actually I should put it all here. All right, any money that I make, I'm putting stuff like over here, I guess. I don't know. All right, I'm gonna try it. I'll try this. We'll say, I don't know. Oh, I don't even have, like... Oh, I have these, like, like ground, like, bomb things on. I don't even know if I like that. Oh my god, oh my god, I got fucking destroyed. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Put me back. Shit's gonna happen. This is gonna be rough. I don't want them destroying my damn turrets, so like is go around and destroy all these things. Like, I don't even know. A base is under attack? Fuck. Not for long, not for long. Put down another one. Fuck. Oh my god. It's... Oh good. Can I like... 25%? Who's left? Anybody? There's like other guys here. I can't even see them. Oh, they're there. Somebody else is here. Or is it like something that they shot onto my base and then I'm like waiting for it to go away? Or like what? Maybe it's because my base is on fire. <laughs> is that the problem? Is my base on fucking fire and then I can't even like... Like what am I supposed to do? Like, I don't even know. Destroyed all of our conventional forces. Nevertheless, the super heavy Acrono plan has arrived. It was meant for a counterattack in Europe, but it'll face the aliens here. I'm authorizing the use of Red Wing KM2. Red Wing 
KM2 reporting. What? Direct approach of the alien base is obstructed. Engaging lasers to clear the way. Oh my god. Of the red wing lasers. Starting a direct attack against the export core. Uh, um. <laughs> if they gave me like a couple minutes to like set up for this, I, I I'd be down. Impossible. Impossible, huh? How about give me, give me. I need a minute to set up for this. You need you need to give me time. Yeah, I didn't have any time to set up anything. No shit, tower destroyed. I it was just on the way. How am I supposed to do that if I have no fucking time to lay it out? Mike's layout of the bases always upsets you in this game. Well, they didn't give me any fucking time to even lay anything out. We're powering up the red wing lasers, starting a direct attack against the export core. LOL, that's why you buy the game and do it yourself. Yeah, seriously, go fucking play it yourself if you don't like, you know. If, if, if you're bothered by it, then seriously, say, why don't you say something about what you think, where I should put things or something. Instead of just saying that, first of all, or second of all, just if you like the, if you, if this game is like interesting to you or whatever, go play it yourself. It's like, whatever. But like, you know, offering no help doesn't help. And then also about the set, setting up the layout of it, it's like, how am I supposed to set up the layout when the, when it doesn't give me any fucking time? Like, I needed like five minutes to fucking prepare for that fucking thing, and then he just came, and then I couldn't even move anything. I guess I'm just gonna go attack the thing myself. Like, I don't have time to set up shit. Here, I, there's, they give you no time, so fuck it. I guess I'm gonna go. slammed into it. How is this possible? You might need to replay previous mission. Your base health is pretty bad to start out with. Yeah, like... Direct approach of the alien base is obstructed. Can I blow off like one? Side of it? Laser overload. We have to turn it off or it will blow. Oh. The damage is too high. Abort all attacks and deploy the afterburner. We have to change the attack plan. Oh. All right. Now what's up? <laughs> Fuck. All right, so all this shit, they're still coming through here. I got to look at this again. So So what does that mean? Okay, that, they're going to drop guys there. But yo, I don't want them to drop shit. Oh, they're all coming from here. Wait a second. Hold up a second. What if we just fucking... How about I just blow them up in the first place? 
you can't even come down here because you're just dead. Game, like, game over. As soon as you come out of the fucking gate, you're fucking dead. How about that? That's my fucking method. Like, suck my dick. All that shit, dead, right? Like, and then these guys, well, they're coming from here. And they're coming all the way down here. And then they're dropping shit off there. Okay. Hang on a minute. I don't even want them getting to me. Give me some of my shit back and then we'll just say, I'm gonna make it so they can't even fucking get over to me. And then this shit. Well, maybe anti-air. I guess. I guess I have to anti-air this area too, huh? there. He's, they, he starts getting fucked up and then, oh, he's dropping him right there. I can't let him even get to that spot. Like, right out of the gate, he's gotta go. You think that's enough to take care of that? Fucking better be. So those go for this. And blow him up, hopefully, before he gets to there. That's my hope and prayer. Right? And then what's gonna happen? These, my hope is that they can't even drop them off at all because the fucking plane is blown. I blew the plane up. Same thing for here. They can't even fucking get over there. They can't even get over there. And then what's going on with this shit? Again, same shit. This is all the same shit. So yeah, here. I want more of that going on. I don't want to not have... I don't want that to fail. So, like, two might not be enough for this. I need another one. I need another one. I need this to get fucked up. There. That's that plane. Fuck him up before he gets there. I'm just... Like double checking anything. This one, he's gonna get dropped off. And that's gonna get dropped off. That's all from this plane, right? That might, these actually might not even be enough to do what I want. I need one more. Hold up. I'm gonna have another one. They're gonna get fucking blown away like fucking crazy. <laughs> like, come on. You think that's enough? This, like, and also, like, right now, this isn't doing me any fucking good, right? I don't think. Actually, if he did go that far, well, no, I don't even want them getting that far. That's not even, well, you know what? Fuck it. And then there's, like, one here, here. So this needs to be here. I, I'm gonna put it in another one. It's gonna be there. That's like my last sort of defense if that thing makes it through all that. It might. Well, that's why we're fucking putting more down. I like, I also, I don't know if tanks are gonna be coming and shit. Like, cause like, well, the, the only place I think the tanks are coming from is if they get dropped off, right? So, that's my fucking idea here. If you're not following, like, I'm just like, fuck all that. There aren't. There will be no enemies because they get fucking blown up right out of the gate. There will be. There won't even be enemies. Then this fucking. I mean, this is a drop ship, right? It has to be because it's got those little spots. What if that's not enough? What if I? Yeah. What if I need to have one right here? Oh wait, that's he's getting. It can't be there. He'll get like a. He'll get bombed on. This needs to be here. Hopefully I'm not misunderstanding what this mission is. I think these drop off tanks. Uh, Drew, Drew, thank you very much. So how's your night? I mean, I don't know. I'm just playing this fucking game. It's pretty cool. 
All right, so I mean, yeah, and all these, that's a drop spot. Like that's a drop spot, right? All right, so let's let's see if these guys can't even get through. That's my hope and prayer. All right, let's see. We're starting attacks from a distance. Attacking the S-4-4 with heavy long-range missiles. Engines damaged. We have to slow down. Another engine damaged. We're flying even slower. This is not what I thought this was. Dude, I thought those were all drop ships. Wait. I thought those were gonna be a bunch of drop ships dropping off like tanks and shit. That's not what I thought that was. All right, hold up. Red Wing KM2 reporting. Direct to oh, don't make me do this part again. Fuck. It brought me all the way back to here? All right, now I gotta fucking read. All right, well, at least now I know what I gotta do, though. I, I should be able to redo this, I hope. I, I know what to do now, though. He leaves. Damn it. Damage is too high. Abort all attacks and deploy the afterburner. We have to change the attack plan. Unbelievable. All right. I, gee, I don't know why it took me back as far as it did. It usually doesn't do that. Potential drop zones have been marked. Possibly more towers. All right. Gee, I wish I could have saved it. That's the first time I've, I've had this game really like do something like that, where I feel like it's like, here. All right, so I know it comes from here. So here's what's gonna happen. Now that I, now that I understand what's going on. Now this fucking cocksucker is gonna get fucked up. Oh, that's in the zone? Seriously? Fuck you. <sighs> Hang on. I will fucking make this happen. That's just that. We need more than that. So he's like, and also, what if he's getting fucked up on the other side? Hopefully this is close. I mean, look at the range on that. It's pretty good. Anywhere, like, over here, and we're putting in these, like, missile things. Like, that's pretty good. All right, so right out of the gate, he gets hit like crazy. All, all, by the way, all this shit's just gonna go. Now that I know it's not like gonna be like dropping these tanks and whatever I thought it was gonna be before. So you have to like totally rearrange all this shit. It's like anti-air. I, I have to make sure that they're like in the right spots. So, okay. So having all this, I don't know where it goes like next. Fuck. Like, I guess it can go in any, maybe, it, maybe it's randomized. Like maybe the ship can come out anywhere. I'm hoping it comes out at that top of like left again. It would be almost nice if there was numbers, if it was like one, two, three, four, like to tell you like which way. So it's gonna fly down there and then what, like come from the bottom next or something? Like I don't fucking know what it's gonna do. Guess I'm gonna find out. <laughs> I 
guess we're gonna find out. So it's all that. And then it's gonna go along here. Also, I don't wanna have to fucking do this again. So I, I wonder if I can make sure that I like save it somehow. Where is it? Oh, this is down here. Like, yeah, like all this shit needs to go too. Boy, what a mess, huh? To kill this boss. Take all this shit away. Alright, so he's gonna come. I want this just like going down the entire path and fucking him up. You better be able, I better be able to like save this so that I don't have to redo this. Let's have another, let's have like more over here. And of course that's in the fucking way. So this is here, let's have it like here. This is fucking wild, huh? All right, so it's like, he'd get fucked up there. Now what about this pathway? I need this top pathway done too. I mean, I got that, but how about on this side? How about one here? I, like, literally all this stuff in the middle needs to go. I'm assuming we're done with, like, all the tanks. At this point now, it's all just about this, like, ship. So everything is anti-air. I wonder if there's a button you can hit to just kind of like wipe everything on on the screen, which if there was, I could have like done that in the beginning to make this quick quicker. Like you just take back all of your ships all together, you know? Damn it. How about one here? You think that's gonna be a red? Looks like it's not. Um. I put him there. God damn it. Oh. <sighs> really? Even still there? And that one is too. Anywhere. Oh, geez, I'm getting like way too close, I guess, here. I have to like pull, the, pull it back further. All right, so listen. He comes out, all that shit hits him. I could even, I'm gonna have another. Let's have one here. Good. All right, this is pretty good now, but now I don't wanna have to do this again, so can I save this? You know, like, I'm worried that I'm gonna have to like redo all that if I die. Just win? Yeah, I guess, it better. Hang on, that's under fire, so I need to take that out. Let me back that up, I guess, and put it like back here. Then he can't be attacked. All right, I'm gonna try this. I really fucking hope here we go, I'm gonna do it. This is too dangerous to be in core. We're starting attacks from a distance. Shit. Attacking the X-Morph core with heavy long-range missiles. Engines damaged. We have to slow down. Three engines destroyed. The alien wants to slow us down. 
Oh, so they were. Uh oh. So he is, so he is like dropping shit off still. Fuck. Uh oh. Maybe having. Oh, maybe this isn't the method, man. Here, I need. Here, 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 here. Here. Oh boy. Can I please fucking put stuff down, please? It's like, I wish I. You can't pause it to fucking put shit down. I kinda wish I could. Jesus. Fuck, man. Alright. Now what is happening? Um, oh, there's some enemies down here. Alright. There. And these are all the guys that are coming. Build more tower. Hey, Mike, build more towers. Thanks for the... So I don't fucking know at this point. I mean, that saved the last thing, right? I don't know at this point where this fucking ship is coming from. Fuck. I think I made it through that last one, though, so that should be saved here. Like... Like, hopefully. Like, I don't even fucking know now. Oh, also, look at this. So, like, the... Fuck. This one's a bitch. It's like every round, it's almost like... You gotta, like, fucking replace everything. It's kind of a pain in the ass. See, I'm not used to that. Most tower defense games are, like, you place your shit, and then... You don't usually have to like replace them. It's just like you kind of upgrade them. This is like changing the fucking map every time. I don't, I don't know about that. Anyway, so like over here. Here. No, the, he, all right. They're going to come out. He's going to come out of here. He's going to fly here. He might come right down the middle. I just don't know. They don't fucking, like, tell you, you know, I guess, so... I'm gonna assume that he's probably gonna come, like, out of this shit. Oh, yo, I could put... Can I... Oh, I can't place anything there? Great. Can't place anything there. If I put it there, it's gonna be red, right? Oh, it's not? Wow, that's a surprise. How is that not something that he can bomb? It didn't make any fucking sense. I mean, like, really. I can put down so many things, it's crazy. Here. So when he flies by that, one way or the other, I guess he's flying by this area, so I might as well just put down a hundred fucking things. Right, so that's, like, all that. Tanks and shit are gonna come, and then I'm gonna be unhappy because they're all, like, fucking me up. I mean, pretty much, right? So it's like, God knows where they're going to fucking come from. So I better have some protection. And I won't have the time to, like, do anything about it. So I'll just protect the base area as much as I can. Because I don't know which fucking way they're going to... Because this plane, this plane is going to come out from one of one, two, three, three or four directions. This giant fucking plane is going to come out, and I don't know which one. If there, if there was a number, but I guess that's the whole thing. They don't want you to fucking know which route it's going to come out of. Because they're just like, they're like, hey, fuck you. You don't know. Could be anything. It's like, fuck. 
So at least I know if there's some fucking protection in the middle, like, that can't hurt because that's where they're fucking going. <laughs> right? All right, I guess I'm starting it. Here, let's try. I don't fucking know. Where is he coming from? Is the middle? It's the middle. Half of our engines are destroyed. We're losing thrust. We're powering up the red wing lasers. Starting a direct attack. Laser overload. We have to turn it off or it will blow. Oh, good. Fuck off. Another wing fragment destroyed. One of our weapon systems has been destroyed. Good. Our firepower is decreasing. Firing an artillery barrage against the alien core. Shells on cover. Ba a barrage? I mean, a barrage? Did they say barrage? You say barrage or barrage? We're barely staying up in the air. Most of our lip surface is gone. We may destroy one more. You say tomato, I say tomato. Another weapon system destroyed. The alien is weakening our firepower. I'm trying to weaken your firepower. That's the whole fucking point, asshole. We're becoming defenseless. You're, oh, you're becoming defenseless? Oh, darn. I'm so upset for you. You say potato, I say potato. Potato, potato. <laughs> what is this shit? No, no, no. You're not allowed to do that. Oh, is it like parachute motherfuckers? Uh oh. Is it? The wings are gone. We're falling down. Tower so destroyed. Tower so destroyed. Uh oh. Uh, is, are there tanks coming out of it? Did I do it? We've been defeated. Oh. I don't see a way of stopping their metallic structures from growing. We're relocating all remaining forces to China. The aliens haven't reached there yet. Well done. The humans are retreating. We need to watch for this type of enemy action in the future. Based on their communications, it looks like they are learning from their mistakes and are preparing even more powerful machines. Prepare to transfer your consciousness to the next alien. Alright, so I beat it. Holy shit. Congratulations. All right, so, geez, made it just barely. All right, oh, we're gonna be going to USA. Oh, it's like, yo, they're adding levels in between. After you beat levels, they're adding in more levels. So I have to go, so I'm going to Australia. Oh, we're gonna go do Australia? Good day. All right. Um. So I have more technology now. Uh, so wait, 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 what can I, I don't know if I want, I want more turret stuff. I wish I had the upgrades, but I don't. So yo, ooh, what's this? So that's an upgrade for the flamethrower thing. This is, I want these back, my artillery towers that they like took away because I had to that I had to do this. I don't I don't need two types of this. I feel like I'm gonna take one of those off. They did, like made me have that before, so now I don't think I need it. So I want that back. I liked this. I want that back. 
And now that I have one left, I'll, I guess I'll buy a laser tower. No, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save my money because I want, I want to be able to get some of this other stuff. So I'll, I'll just save it. Um, what I really want is all these upgrades. So maybe the in between, maybe if I do Australia, they'll give me like one upgrade point or something. I wish I knew. I wish it tells you like what you're gonna get. I mean, I mean maybe it does somewhere. But regardless. All right, so I'm going to be doing, um, we're gonna do Australia now. Uh, let, real quick, let, let me just grab a, uh, a cup of coffee. So give me like two minutes and then I'll be right back. And we will, we will assimilate Australia. Is, are any of you guys from Australia? Is anybody in here from Australia? I know there's a few people that watch me that are. That are so for all the Australians co coming up in a minute, we're gonna, I'm going to, um, I'm going to assimilate you all and make you all into Borg. <laughs> So that's what we're going to do. All right, I'll be back in just like two minutes. I'll be right back.
All right, how's it going? I am back. I am playing X Morph Defense. X Morph Defense for PC, and it's a uh, it's a tower defense game. And I like to play X Morph Defense specifically. I like the Australia stage because. Um, what's really neat about it is you can charge your electromagnetic pulses and you can shoot your EMP charge process and you can use your ground units and it's that kind of game. It's that kind of game. It's great. No, I like it. I love it. I don't care. You, I'm like the biggest nerd in the world, but like then I then I make fun of nerds, so it's like it makes no sense. <laughs> it makes no sense. I it makes no sense for me to make fun of nerds when I am sort of um, would I be? Do am I the king of the nerds? <laughs> I feel like I might be. They're here. See, you know what though? I don't know if I'm a, I'm a nerd though, because I feel like a nerd is more like you have to have you have to be kind of smart to be a nerd. I think. So I'm very dumb. So I think I'm more in the. Um, I think geek also implies a little bit of like intelligence, right? I think I'm more of a dork. See, a dork is doesn't necessarily have to have any type of intelligence. So I think I'm probably a dork. Don't you think? You're more of motherfucker Mike. Well, there that too, but... Wait, so you have geek, dork. What am I missing? There's like one of those words. <laughs> geek, dork, nerd... Um, what's, give me more words for that. Dweeb. I'd say you're a dweeb. Oh, a dweeb. Oh, you know what? That might be what I am. I think I'm a dweeb. <laughs> Don't you think that? I think that that really, like, nails down A fucking pussy. <laughs> Poindexter. Oh, I want that. Can I have that? Can we? Can I at least have that? I. That's what I want. I'm a uh, Poindexter. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Can I, I would. I would at least want that. Give me that much. Can Can we at least? Um. Actually, I would say that's probably even a downgrade from Dweeb. There, we should do like a list of like what's like worse than the next. Poindexter would be pretty low. Poindexter is smarter than a nerd. Oh, you know what? I kind of agree with that. Poindexter is like like an ultimate nerd, you know? I'm yeah. I guess I'm not a Poindexter. Now I'm upset. I guess I'm. I guess I'm just a, a, a dweeb. <laughs> Uh, wait, dweeb is a boring, studious, or inept? Studious? That's not me either. See, this is why I call myself an asshole. Because <laughs> I think that that probably might really be the most accurate. No, Mike is not studious. No, I agree. So I don't think I'm a. I don't. I, I'm not a dweeb either. Then. Then we. Adam says, "Oh, so then we can all agree that you're an asshole." I think so. I think that that's more. Um, do, can you do, can you guys define? Do, now define an asshole. Like not like your your asshole. Like, not like your butthole. <laughs> oh, maybe that's what I am. Maybe I'm a butthole. <laughs> maybe that's what it is. Oh my god. <laughs> asshole equals Mike Mattei. See, I mean that's a pretty good definition. Doesn't that make sense? 
So maybe too common. Oh god, we're not doing that. All right, I'm going. We're going on. We're going to Australia. Let's go to Australia. No, seriously, is anybody here from Australia? I know that there's at least one or two people that watch my streams that are, so, hi. Another core is approaching the designated landing location. Australian lies on the opposite side of the planet from our bases in Europe. A base in this area will enable us to increase the resonance of geodetic waves. It is required to modify this planet's metallic core. Unfortunately, the landing site is situated at the center of the human settlement. This can complicate the expansion process. Prepare to defend the core. So their goal is to... Sending in heavy assault gunships against the Exmoor fighters. This will give the civilians more time to evacuate. The Wait. So their goal is to modify the metallic core of the planet? So they're saying the inside of the planet has a metallic core and that they want to modify the core of the planet. So what happened? Let's say that we do it. I wonder what, I guess maybe if I beat this, maybe that maybe it'll happen, we'll see. Like, will the whole planet just become like a robot or something? This is awesome. I like love this game. Like seriously. The center of the city. After leveling Berlin, they clearly want to intimidate us. Sound the evacuation alarm for all civilians. Like this is what I fucking want, man. Holy shit. Who made the I don't even know. I didn't even look. Who made this game? Like love the whole the whole thing about this. Hang on a second. Let's, I don't even know. I, I didn't even really look. Somebody like recommended it to me and then I'm just like, well, I'll try it because I, I like tower defense. So this is X, XOR Studios? I never heard of them before. Oh, they made another game too, ooh. So they have another game called Rift Breaker. Okay, I haven't tried that. I wonder is that I wonder if that's also tower defense. Alright, so it's some studio that I haven't heard of before. Hmm. Well that's kinda cool. I like um knowing about other, you know, um developers and whatever that I haven't so like for me, I know like uh you know like IREM I know Ocean. I know Wisdom Tree. Um, gee. <laughs> Those are the ones I'm used to. <laughs> it's not Tower Defense. Whoa, what, the other game? Rift Breaker is ass. Oh, is it? Tower defense is not your jam, but this is cool. Oh my god! So, listen, I lo duck system. I like. I love you, and thanks for being here. S seriously, you're you're always here, and so I'm not gonna try to give you a hard time. But like, I so I'll be like in in real life, and on you know if you're on like online on social media or whatever. Whenever, I just like. Oh, somebody would be like, um, can we stop saying that? It's my jam. I'm so, like, I hate that so much. Oh, oh, Mario Kart's my jam. You know, it's my jam. Everything's my jam. Stop saying that. I hate that. Please. Does anybody else hate that a fucking expression? Jam it up your ass? No, not, that, that one's fine. I'm fine with jamming up your ass. It's when you like something and you say, it's my jam. What's your jam, Mike? People who don't use that expression. You hate it with a passion? So Senketsu. Jelly is worse. Oh. I Yeah, I hate that too. I mean, I hate a lot of things. But the it's my jam one, like, that one gets me. 
It's jam. Yeah, it's jam. Mike prefers planter all fruit. You're good with the puns. Yeah, you, you don't want to say planter all fruit. You don't want to say jam. Will you please punch the jelly? I would like to do an interview with that guy if he's around still. Um, if, if you're around and you happen to see this, if you're the guy who did that commercial and you said, Can you please pass the jelly? I will pay you real money to come and do a stream with me and say that over and over and over. That's my dream stream. And then also, if we can work out those pirate ships, if I could... Mm, if I do get pirate ships and then I could stream from a pirate ship, I, my first officer will be the guy from that commercial and he will just, he'll say, I'll be like, I'll be like, oh, uh, where are we setting course to, uh, first officer? And he'll say, I don't know, can you please pass the jelly? That'll be the ship that we're all gonna be on. If anybody wants to go on this ship, one day, one day, that's my dream. My, the, my dreams are a problem. All right, anyway, so we're in Australia. I have to get back to this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't, it, it gets to the point with these, I don't even know what I'm talking about. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Sometimes, we, they're, like, lately people come in here and they're like, I look over at the chat and they're like, what is Mike talking about? I don't even know right now. I'm talking about the guy from the Planner All Fruit commercial from like the early 90s who says, Can you please pass the jelly? I want that guy to be on a pirate ship with me as my first officer. That's what I'm talking about. As I play a tower defense game, it has nothing to do with a tower defense game. I'm not good at live streaming. I've said this before, and then people say, ah, oh, you're pretty good at live streaming. No, 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 no. If you were good at live streaming, you would, I, I would be able to do great commentary. See, if I could do great commentary over this tower defense game, that, I would love to be able to do that. But I can't do that because inside my head, I have, a, a, like, I have puppets screaming inside my head. I have uh, there's an argument going on right now between Klingons. There's all kinds of things happening. It's a problem. It's just the voices. <laughs> there's all these voices go going on. Beavis and Budhead are going back and forth. It's a problem. All right, so let me do this. So anyway, we're in Australia. We're taking over. I am a Decepticon and we are taking over Australia. This would be an amazing game for them to get a license. Here's what you want to do. Here's what you want to do. X-Morph Defense and Transformers. They come together. So you remember that game Smite? There was Smite, and then they got a license with Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and then Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles was in Smite. Get this game gets the license of Transformers, and then these all these ships flying around. You don't change the game. They got it down with the gameplay. I'm not talking about don't change the game. Game's good. Just make have a have another DLC where you can play through a whole story campaign. And it's the same game. Don't change the game. But the ship, instead of the ship I have here, it's fucking Starscream. And the enemies that come out are like the Autobots and shit. That would be amazing. That could be so good. That's what I want. That's the license. If you're gonna do a license, that's the one you get. Otherwise, don't do it. If it's not Transformers, I don't want to. I don't want it. Well, that's not true. It could be He-Man too. You could have the Wind Raider, um, or it could be Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and you could have like the Blimp. Actually, it could be like a lot of things besides Transformers. Could be like Sesame Street. Could be all kind. Of, could be anything. Actually, could totally be anything. Anyway, all right. So. Um, 
here's what's going to happen. So these uh, sh ships are coming out of here, right? So this is going to be uh, uh, ships. And I'm going to put down a... I'm going to put down an air defense module, whatever the fuck it's called. There's going to be one of those. And we're going to put it down another one. And those are going to take out that shit. And now I don't have to worry about that, I don't think. So these motherfuckers are going to come down the street, but they're going to join up over here, and they're all going to be going down the street, and they're trying to make it to my base. Mm-mm. No, no. We can't have that happen, can we? Mm-mm. So we got to put in all kinds of cool little devices. Can I, like, make this into anything else? So, ooh, yes, I can. Dude, one of these motherfuckers. Oh, yeah, I like that shit. We're going to do one of those. Yeah. By the way, that, when they go, it's like they're transforming. Yo. This is so fucking good. I love this. If I made a game, I'm not. I want to be clear about something. I have no interest in making, I don't want to make a game. Um... I mean, maybe if somebody else is making a game, I like to, like, be like, oh, you could do this or that or whatever, uh, give some suggestions. But, like, if I ever did, like, make something, I'd probably make something like this, similar to this. Like, this is a fucking fan. I, I, like, love the tower defense genre. I feel like, has anybody done, you know what you do? I don't know how it could be done, but you take a game like this, like a tower defense, Here's what I want. I want a game like this that's tower defense, but you then you fucking take it and you get a good license for it. You make it like Masters of the Universe or you make it like Ninja Turtles or something like that. You make it like a cool like 80s franchise and then on top of that, you find a way to make it also a roguelike. I want a roguelike tower defense with a fucking really good like license is what I want. Maybe it could be uh, Hanna Barbera <laughs> or something. Not really, but yeah. There's so many cool things that you could do. All right, anyway, uh, let's get this going. I guess I'm gonna start this. Pass, pass you some of that coffee. Yeah, I, I, listen, I wish there was something in it. There's not, but that'd be great. That, yo, if there was something in there, that'd be, that'd be great. <laughs> fries? What French French fries in the coffee? That's a horrible thought. I'm not eating even eating carbohydrates. So like that's not happening. But French fry even if I was, French fries in coffee. That's just, that's no. That's no. No. I don't think french fries in coffee is a good idea. Sorry, no. That's, that's, that's a no from me. Put this here. Like how this is already fucked. Warships attacking the alien. We good? No, I guess not. Oh my god. Damn, damn, damn. You know what I want to play again too, by the way, and I know I've done it already, but I want to do Mylon Secret Castle again. This is the fucking problem, is that I always want to come back to games that I already fucking streamed, because I have like other things that I want to do with them. There's a second quest, I think, to Mile on Seeker Castle. So I beat I beat Mile on Seeker Castle on stream. Air support attacking aliens. 
so it's like, I could be, it's like, that should be good enough, right? But no, not for Mike Matei. I gotta do the fucking second quest, right? But I grew up with that game. I'm like nostalgic for it, so like. I like strangely kind of like that game. Kind of. Fuck. It's like bad and good. I mean, that's why I wanted to write a AVGN video for it. It's one of those. I like the AVGN videos that are like the half bad, half good. It's kind of like, I wrote the Zelda 2 one as well, and it's like, I mean, I think Our Zelda 2 was just arrived. mostly good, but there's a, there's really a couple, only a couple of real problems I have with it. But those are the ones I like that it's like Castlevania 2, Zelda 2, or I think those are the really interesting ones because it's like, um, there's good things to say about it, but there's bad things to say. So it's kind of, you know why? Because it's controversial, right? Or it's kind of like, uh, or like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's, it's a really good game, but it has, you know, has some flaws. Um, the really good ones, I think, are ones that are sort of like half half and half. There's a lot to complain about, but then there's also like a lot of good. Because if it's just all bad, then it's like, all right, it's obvious that it's like all bad. But I, that's what I really like. I think it's more interesting when it's like got good and bad, and then there's like more to say. Zelda 2 is a good game, but not your favorite Zelda. Um, it's up there for me. Uh, I don't, I don't know if it's my favorite, but. Um, it's definitely up there. The thing that I don't like really about Zelda 2 is the like the overworld map and the little like guys that walk around the overworld map, little little monsters, and then you got the, when they hit you, you know. I don't like that part of the game. That could just straight up go. I think the you know it would be a cool thing to do for like a Zelda 2 hack. Do like Zelda 2 hack, but totally re rethink how that overworld works because I think that's one of the things that people don't really like about it is like walking around that overworld I mean at least that's something that I don't really like about it I like when it then you, you know you go into the like the palaces and then it's just side scrolling or whatever all that's pretty great um what if, yo what if you did a Zelda 2 hack and it had more of a Mario 3 map to where you, it's like it's the overworld map of Mario 3 but then you make it look more like Hyrule right and then you just go for like 1 2 3 like that instead of like you're kind of like going all over you know and I know it's like Zelda, and that's sort of the point. It's like this open like world thing. But like for Zelda two, that might be like something interesting to try. Um, because then it, because I feel like one of the reasons a lot of people don't like Zelda two is they don't know where to go or like what to do. So if you, if the overworld map was just like oh you go to one, you go to two, you go to three, and then then you're just like in the levels, then that might make it more accessible to more people. You know, just just as an idea, like not that I would not I not that I would want the original game to have been that way. I like what Zelda Two is or was, um, but as like a hack, it might be something to try. Maybe I don't know. Just an idea. Zelda Bros 3, right? Some people say Zelda 2 sucks ass. I know, that's why I wanted to do the AVGN episode on it. Um, I, I, like, put down all the... Or, like, I tried... I have to rewatch like, what I said about that, but I tried to put down all the things that are bad about it, and then all the things... I probably write it a little different these days than I did then, but... Anyway, uh, all right... Anyway, so, all right, so, God, what am I going to do here? I need to reroute this, first of all. Can I, if I, ooh. 
wait, I'm getting some ideas here. Hang on. Oh, there's a few things that need to go. So they're, they're going to come down here. Can they turn down the street and go this way? Or they turn. Well, this is, that's too close to this. Huh. I wonder if I can make. Let's see if I can make that happen. Hold on. Is that something that can happen? Oh, it goes back around that way. Okay, well, I mean, that's good. Turns them around. Then... Wouldn't it be nice? You know what? I'm just gonna take these out. Wouldn't it be nice if I could just make this go into that, essentially? So let's try to do that. Basically like here to here, yeah. Sweet. Is everything going along that? So everything's like there. Oh, but this isn't. Unless if I turn it there and then they go, oh, and then they could line up with that. Perfect, that's what you wanna do. So yo, let me see if I can do that now. So like, uh, uh, like that. Yes, oh, but those guys can get through. So that just means I need a flamethrower. Let's put a flamethrower in. And then I'm gonna put another one like, I'll just put like a regular turret here. Hopefully that takes them out. Um, okay. So everybody now comes from this direction. This is like way better. So now I gotta fuck them up. You know, oh, you know what I need? I want, I need some of these, I need some of this shit going on. Okay, that's that, and then Behind here, I'll just have some regular, like, turrets going down. Oh, I, like, ran out already. But anyway, that's pretty... Oh, fuck, wait a second. There's one more big problem here. Is this ship. So I need... Wait a second, what's this doing here? Where does this start? It starts from... Oh, those are anti-air right there. Yo, there should be one ra I should have an anti-air here. There we go. That should be enough to fucking take all that out. Don't have to worry about that. Everybody comes down the street here. So all I gotta do is just like put a bunch of fucking shit there. Okay, I think this is pretty well set up now. There's a go there's a lot of enemies that are coming. Shit. All right, well let's try it. Mobile artillery team ready to enter mission zone. Let's put in more.
definitely a bit worried here. Fuck. Uh oh. Artillery coming up in a moment. Please stand by to confirm visual. Air support. Experiencing heavy losses. We need air support. We need it now. Oh no. Fucking hell. Come on, get the fuck out of here. Fuck out of my face. God damn it. 25? I'm only on wave two of five? Oh my god. And is the damn thing gonna repair itself? I need some kind of base repair thing. We need air support on station ASAP. These guys are fucks. Here. Oh, he's running away from me? Yeah, fuck you. Well, that didn't go too hot. We are expanding the battle zone and commencing an assault from the beach. The battle zone has been expanded. Is this Newark? Yes. This is... <laughs> you disagree with my favorite things? Like what? Pew, pew, pew. Yep. Did I make Australia my alien bitch yet, Mike? I'm working on it. I'm trying. I don't... I'm getting fucked up here. How many teraflops are required to play this game? I'll give you a teraflop. Look at this situation. Oh my god. Look at this fucking mini-map. Alright, so these guys... This is coming from over here. Let's see if I can reroute this shit or something. Can I make it go over here? It doesn't even seem like it. Unless I can... I don't think so. Like, right? Unless this bridge comes down eventually or something. I don't think I even can. I, it's like I could reroute it to go around this building, which might buy me a second. <laughs> but, like, I mean, I guess I could actually do that. What the hell? It gives me a little extra time, and they'll be shooting them the whole time. Um, like I guess. I can make this one of these. I don't know. This is gonna be rough. So they're all. Oh, and then these guys can still get in here. I haven't really had a problem with that yet. I think the, between the flamethrower and this thing, that's probably pretty good. It's just this shit is the problem. Um, and what happens also is that 
these like aircraft come in and then just like fuck me up. So like, how about I have an anti-air? I'm gonna have an anti-air so that I'm not getting as screwed over by that shit. And then I can just like kind of fight over here. I guess. That's some anti-aircraft stuff. Also, that takes care of some of this. And then, where's this coming from? Comes all the way around there. Yeah, th I mean, those shouldn't even make it over here. So what I have to do, basically, is put down more turrets over here, obviously, and then basically turrets over here like up here or something. I should probably just put them like right here. So basically like, turrets here and like maybe some more in here or some shit. Okay. All right. Artillery ready. Stand by for heavy pounding. Stand by for heavy pounding, everyone. <laughs> Stand by. I didn't know they were gonna get so fucked up there. Um, here. If I make it by this one, it's gonna be a fucking miracle, isn't it? Actually, I'm having these anti-air things here as it wasn't a bad idea either. Fuck. They're still making their way in. God. Put it down. Oh, I'm dead. I'm, I'm gonna die. air here. Can I do one? Holy shit, I made it. God. 
able to connect to the energy source and divert the power to support additional towers. This will help us in defending the region. Sure, I'd be glad to go over there and put a fucking thing down. You got it, buddy. I'm sending heavy tank reinforcements. We'll try stronger attacks from the east and the north. Well done. A tower placed in this location will reach energy from the power plant to fed this spot to receive additional resources. Intelligence reports Defend that, that spot. Sure. connected to the city's main power hub and are draining energy for their own purposes. I am sending additional units to destroy the tower that is serving as an energy relay. Energy relay, huh? Damn it, give me that. All right, so this, all right, so this is gonna come over. Uh, wait, what? There's so much happening. So this is all new. Oh. Okay. Wait a second. I got it. I got it. We gotta. <laughs> we gotta clean up this mess a bit. All right. Let's take away another. These are kind of far away anyway. All right. So yo, up here. Probably all like on top of this fucking thing. Here we go. Or not. Wow. Yeah, really not. Fuck. So that can go down. That can go there. That can go there. I, I know I gotta take this out. Yeah, so <laughs> can't do that, but I bet yeah, I can put them over here. About like oh. that might be right. Oh, where these truck things are. Damn it! I need more shit over there. That that can just take them all out right there. Here, let's take away this guy. I guess let's take away that for now. I don't know. I want this shit to all be. Oh, I gotta make sure it's anti-air. What am I doing? I guess that. That. The other one needs to be too. Um, God damn it. Uh, let's take out this one. That should be enough to... That's anti-air, that's anti-air. That's anti-air. So all these are anti-air. Hopefully that would be enough to take out that. <sighs> that's the dream. Um, so they can't even get there. Then, having a couple anti-airs in the middle have been really helpful. This area is a fucking mess. I'm gonna make this one an anti-air. Like, don't you think this, like, I think this, this area is just fucking absolute fucking mess. It's like, that's what I could do in that time period to, you see, these guys gotta go like around here. Let's have one here so they're being like attacked. I want them, I want like a nice steady, like they're being attacked the whole fucking time. The other part of the problem, though, is that they bring in these fucking things that are like, that just can take these out. So you need to have that shit here, oh, like, you know, so your towers don't get like destroyed the whole fucking time. Um, and everybody converges, like, and this would be a good area to have some like shit for sure, too. Actually, look at how that's a, yo, I need like a flamethrower thing over there. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Um, tell you what. I'm going to take out 
that, and I hate to take these out, I kind of need them, but I'm going to take them out, and I don't want these, like, foot soldier guys coming, so I'm going to put in the flamethrower thing here. That'll take care of the foot soldier guys. Um, everybody comes down the path here. I don't know. This might, this might get ugly. I mean, it's probably gonna be ugly. And then, wait a second, and then there's this too. So this is coming out this way, and they, but they go, they have, yeah, they gotta go around. I hope that these, I hope that this can take these out. It, like, that better be strong enough to do that. If it's not, well, if it's not, I got that, and that. That thing's fucked. Okay, I'm not worried about that one. What about this one? I've only got these two, and then is there another one somewhere? Not really. So tell you what, let's take out this. And let's have an anti-air that can get this thing sooner. Maybe there. There. That should be enough now between those two and that to take care of that one. I hope. So, that's pretty good. And then this guy's under attack, but isn't he only under attack from this thing? So as long as, he, they're not gonna get by that. So that should be good. And my other thing is, I don't know if the people over here are gonna attack this. I'm gonna assume that's only gonna get attacked from this plane that's gonna come from above. So, Basically, from here, all I really need to do is, like, this This is bad over here. This is probably the w weakest area, so I need to, like, basically get some more shit by the base. I'm going to start it. Air transport on site. Preparing delivery. Stand by for deployment. Let's see. See if these are getting fucked up pretty good. I would say they're getting fucked up pretty good. Artillery coming up in a moment. Please stand by to confirm visual. Bombers entering danger zone. Are going to release payload on alien structures. Tower is under attack. It is it. Where is the tower under attack from? Like, or are they talking about that like other one? Were they talking about that other little one? Yeah. How did that get taken out? God, it, God only knows. over here. Oh, how is he getting through? We need air support on station ASAP. Fuck.
boy, this is bad. Come on. Come on, come on. Fuck you, fuck you. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck. God damn it. wave at least. Fuck you. Oh shit. <laughs> uh -oh. The aliens have created a real fortress. The number of their towers is still growing. Prepare for the final assault. We have to break through to their core. Alright. <laughs> I don't wanna yo Let's just have that this not be in danger. They won't. Here's what's gonna happen. <laughs> oh my god. This shit won't get there. Is how this is gonna go. Fuck you. It won't be able to get there. Because it has to go through that shit. I think that this one's got to go. And then let's say it got, let's say it did get through there. It, then it's going to be like here. I didn't get my additional resources or whatever. All right, that's all that. I know this is all like under fire, but like that ship won't get to it there. It'll be dead, right? <laughs> I, uh, I hope. They're, they're still coming from here and that's a problem. You know what I didn't like how these guys can like, why is this not, because they broke that down. That's why that was a problem. All right, so tell you what. I will take a few of the, these out. And we'll build this back. This has got to come back. There we go. That's, that's fixed now. Hopefully. Also, I don't see these little feet coming through. So I'm going to sell that. Right? There's no feet this time. So they're going to come down here. la di da di da These guys come along here. There's feet, but they can't make it through because I got the flamethrower. They come up here. Everybody runs around here, and then everybody's over here. Right? So, yo, some of these got to be ant... Some of the, like, I have to make some of these be, uh, what, I keep forgetting the names of it, like this shit. Because otherwise they get taken out. So a couple of those need to be like that, for one thing. Um, I know that they're all red and that seems really bad, but... If the fucking ship doesn't get there and it shouldn't be able to, then I shouldn't. That shouldn't be a fucking problem. So, boom, 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 boom. Between all those, you that can't. And oh, there's no, there's like five. They can't. And then this. Everybody comes along here. What happens? They get fucked up by all that. First of all, then they gotta go around. They get they get hit by that. Then they get hit by that. Then they get hit by all this. You know what? 
How about let's take these two out? And even before they get there, I want them. Oh shit! Shit's coming from the bottom too. Fuck. Oh, and these guys can get through. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna make this a flamethrower. I didn't even realize these foot soldier guys were coming. And then, uh, boy. This is rough. Just like a regular one. We'll see. All right, I'm gonna start it. This is the last wave. I, you know what I wish? I wish it said the percentage of my, what's it called, a harvester? My base, whatever. I wish it said what the percentage was like left. I think it's 25% at this point, but I don't know. I, maybe it's 50%, I don't remember. I kind of wish they told you. Anyway, uh, raid, oh, did I get a raid? Whoever raided, thank you. Sorry, I was like, I'm very like into this. You're going to whip it out and urinate all over this room. All right. You mean my my room here, or do you mean your room where you're watching? You so you're what? So you're watching me play this tower defense game, and you're in your own room, standing in the middle of your room, spinning around in a circle, just like pissing all over your room. <laughs> That's kind of how I imagine most of the people that watch my streams. That's what I imagine, honestly, what's going on. If you were to ask me, what do I think the people that watch my streams are doing? Standing in the middle of their room, spinning in a circle, like, real fast. Pissing. He's peeing, Mike. I know. He told me. Which is, I don't care. That's fine. Whatever, whatever you want to do. Why do they want to beat your ass on the game? Because I'm a space alien and I'm taking over the planet and they don't want their pla planet taken over. They don't want to be assimilated. Didn't you ever see the best of both worlds? <laughs> Go watch best of both worlds and then you'll know. <laughs> All right, I'm going to start the last wave here. I don't know how this is going to go. We'll see. Artillery ready. Stand by for heavy pounding. Stand by for heavy pounding. Stand by. Stand by, everybody. Bomber formation entering kill box. We'll give them hell. For all forces south of the alien base, be advised, southern attack routes are now open. I say again, attack from the south. Okay. Oh, wow. 
Oh wow. Air hands are getting shot down. Fuck, 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 bring me back. Crazy. Some more firepower. Are there enough fucking cannons to take these things out? Like, geez. for a second. Holy shit. Can I live? P please bring my energy back. Bring my energy back. Okay, it's starting to come back. Holy shit.
Come on, come on, come on. Fuck! Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, this is bad. That was the last fucking tank. That was the last fucking tank. You assume this is a much better tower defense game? It is, yeah. Thank you for the raid, Aaron. So I'm playing a tower defense game. This is called uh, X Morph Defense... Um, I think I'm in Australia or somewhere. <laughs> I'm trying to, to defeat. Um, you're basically the Borg. You're aliens. You're taking over Earth. That's the idea. All right, so I'm on mission five of five here. Um, fuck. Man, all right. So, like, this was, like, relatively well set up. So we have, like, that here... That, this is all like the same. None of those, that never got through, so I don't like worry about that. It's just these guys at the end got through and then I was like s fucking screwed, so. I don't know that there's, this is like set up already, I think, right? Basically, so I don't know that there's much else I can change. All right, I like that, all right. It saved like what I did, so all right, I'm gonna start it. See if I can just, I mean, I was so close, I almost had it. Uh, trying to do this way it's so it's wave five of five they do this in waves all <laughs> forces south of the alien base be advised southern attack rounds are now open i repeat attack from the south i mean it'll take so long to get there i should just pay attention to this down here right Eventually need it near here, so. Air support engaging hostile. Like, where did it get really bad? over here oh fucking shit seriously put me back I was not ready for that right there shit
over here. I definitely need the thing where I can fly faster. It's like you really almost wish, wish that you could like pause it to like fucking organize shit better. Look how low my health is. Get off of that! Oh no. Oh my god, oh my god. Get off of that fucking setting! Oh my god, get off of this setting! Ah! It like went to the other fucking gun. That's gonna fucking kill me, that, that just fucking happened. Great. Yeah, of course, because I was stuck on the other fucking gun for the 30 seconds. Oh my god. 
it, I don't even fucking know. It's like fucking RB or something. I hit, and then I couldn't get back to what I was on, and it takes time to fucking charge the thing. That's so fucking frustrating. I just want it to, like, stay on the... There's, like, not time to be switching. I don't have time to switch to, like, the bomb and then wait for the bomb to charge and shit. Like, and then I accidentally fucking hit, like, RB and then... Oh, my God. Go. Just start it. Stand by for heavy pounding. <sighs> fucking hell. Bomber formation entering kill box. We'll give them hell. That's so fucking annoying that that happened. To all forces south of the alien base, be advised, southern... I want to be able to, like, lock... I say again, attack from the south. Like, turn it on so where, like, you can't even fucking switch it. Like, I don't want to switch it to something else. Like... If I kept switching between bomb and the normal gun the whole time. You know how much fucking time that would fucking waste? There's like no time to do that. You know, it's like... Air support engaging hostiles. Are they going around the fucking bend there? I can't let that happen either. So let's fucking put one down there maybe to stop that from happening? I don't even know. They're gonna fucking make it over here. Like, have I learned my lesson yet? So I better, like, here. Air support, attacking aliens. That way when they're surrounding my whole base in a minute, because they're gonna. Fuck. 
I know what's happening. Okay, they broke through the fucking top left thing again. Oh, I don't like when they break my barriers down. Fuck! That's why this is... Fuck. We need air support. We need it now. Air support. Engaging hostiles. Come on. Impossible. Your support ready. We've got your back. Over. How strong are these goddamn things? Very fucking strong. Very, very, very fucking strong. Piece of fucking shit. Welcome to Pound Town. Oh my god. It's like I'm almost making it. I did a video on it, Jerks Productions, on my channel. You can watch that. I love when people always suggest games that like I already did. It's like continual. It's like every stream. One, hey Mike, why don't you play like Batman on AS? You should do that. You play Legend of Zelda. Yeah, exactly. Hey, why don't you play Legend of Zelda? I, I see you've never done that before. So, so, like, I'm almost making this, but then at the end, they're mostly what? Coming from this right area and getting me. And the other fucking thing that's happening is this fence is coming down. Where is it? This shit comes down. And then that really fucks me, too. Because at some point, they break those down and destroy those. So, yo. That means... I know, I know how to fix that. 
That means this fucking thing is gonna be this. That should protect that mate fence, maybe. maybe. Should I have two of them like that? I don't know. So there's 10 million of these here. And they're not really helping me much. Let's have another, like, backup one. Let's have a backup. Let's have two of those. And then maybe this fucking fence won't come down. That'd be nice if that fucking fence didn't come down. The air thing is pretty good. How do I fix this situation? This is the major problem. I don't think they, they never seem to break that fence, so that's not really the problem. It's just that they just really, you know what? I can make the root a lot. Hang on a second, I can fix this. I can do this. Hang on a second. I think I can do this. Hold up. Here's what we're gonna do. Again, here. There we go. That makes their root a little bit longer. Then they go like this. They have to go like this. But what if I also wonder if I could do this here? Too far away. Too common. Um. If we do like that. And then they're gonna go around. Oh, fuck off. I don't wanna necessarily block it, I just wanna. to go up this. I thought that they could go around. Never mind. I get I get what the problem is. Okay, so you I can't do that. So I did make that route a little longer though, which helps a little bit. And they're going to destroy this like in 2 seconds. So the other part is then I have to have this shit going on. Hopefully that protects that. It's probably not even enough to protect it. I probably need two of them. Oh, and then these fucking guys are gonna come. I need a flamethrower here. There's a lot I need. Oh, hold up. There's a lot that needs to happen, huh? I didn't even do any of this before. So, like... This was a flamethrower. All the foot guys get fucked up. Also, this should be... What if I put it here? Then it, then it can also fuck up, like, the tanks and all that shit if it's closer. And it's also fucking up the foot soldier guys. They have to go all the way around this. It makes their path a little longer. Alright, I mean, that's a little better. Um, there, I like it on that one. Oh, all right. I, I don't know how much that's going to help me, but oh, fuck, like, hopefully it's enough. 
hopefully they don't take that down now because I got some better defense. I mean, this is a little better than it was. They still can't get down there. All right, oh, let's try this. Stand by for that heavy pounding. Here we go. Time to get heavily pounded. I thought they come from the south or whatever. They're not going to do that. The Fine. Forces south of the alien now base. they are. Be advised, southern attack rounds are now open. I repeat, attack from the south. I mean, the other pro part of the problem is I did that tower thing bad earlier, so I, I didn't get as many resources as I should have had, I guess, right? So, like... Okay, that takes care of that. Now these guys. I am gonna definitely need more Air things here. I want. I think I want another like air defense thing here. Okay. Oh, you know what? I should build this area up a lot more because they have to go through this fucking shit twice, right? So this, this should be like as built up as I can get it. I should probably have a fucking flamethrower here if I can do it. Here, hang on. Uh... Fuck me up hard. Okay. Let's put some down here. Hostiles. 
sorry, I'm not like talking a lot. I'm just, this is tough. I'm trying to fucking get through this. this shit. Getting so fucking close. So close. You think I need to kill that tank? I, oh yeah, that. That's the second time. It was like the other time it was one tank. This time it was two tanks. I can't fucking believe it. I'm like so close to this. Are they gonna leave that set up the same way as I had it? Let me see what they did. So like, I don't have to fucking redo anything, do I? What did I have? Let's look what I had up here. I had that like fence and shit. Yeah, that's what I how I had it set up. So I did, so that's like still pretty good, but how do I make this better? <laughs> how do I make it a little bit better? It's, it's it's still these ones that come in from over here. So like both I want to like utilize more like both sides like if there's two ways is there any other way I can do that? Let's see. It's got to be like a narrow, like they're going, I don't know if there's another place I can do it. That's why this, this area is so great, because you can get them from both sides. I feel like should really, I'm going to, tell you what, all right. Oh, there's these guys that come from below too, though. I want this area just fucking loaded with stuff since I can get them from two sides. The problem is these guys, they come from the bottom. Um, I'm gonna need shit over there. 
over there, but like here. Like if that area is more built up, it should be better. In fact, why have these over here when I can have them over here? I mean, right? Like, oh, I, can't, I, I always hit the fucking wrong button and then this is the one, right? All right. anywhere else like in the middle I mean like right here maybe come on and then I don't want these being taken out either so like something's got to have that I mean that might be better because like both sides are getting fucking attacked by that shit I mean, it's better these guys are kind of come out though, and it's not going to be enough to protect that. I like that there's two anti-air things there. So like, I need. I want to leave that. Do I necessarily need this? I mean, it's not. Eh, yeah, like not really. Here, let's take take that out. This is very unprotected now. Yo, so this area too. They're going by this, and. I think I should tighten this up. You know, what if I have more guys? Shit, God, stop, oh my God. See, that's not the fucking thing. Oh, fuck one is it? It's not that, what one is it? That, Jesus. I got it, that, I have not gotten used to that at all. All right, anti-air, anti-air there, that's good. Um, I feel like more around here, cause these, yo, know, these guys are coming around the corner here. I'm gonna put more shit here, so like here. Can I make that like a stronger thing? Like what about something like that? I mean that might fuck them up pretty good. I mean that's like a pretty advanced one, right? I guess. Dude, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Look how worried I am about this area. You know what though? When they come up, they're getting like Look at, look at that area. Like, all of these guys will be taking care of these guys on the bottom, at least for a moment, as they're, like, in that area. So that, that this bottom area probably is pretty protected. This is protected. I know this isn't right now, but that's where I'm going to be building shit. They're going to come along here. I'll use my money and plop more stuff down there. All right, let's start this again. Artillery ready. Stand by for heavy pounding. <laughs> they, I swear to God, they must do that on purpose. Stand by for heavy pounding. Fuck you. <laughs> Cock balls and cum. Yeah, sure. To all forces south of the alien base, uh, be advised, southern attack routes are now open. I say again, attack from the south. I think that that can take all that out. I'm not even going to bother with that. Is under that, like, all those fucking things should be able to take that out. Now, I need some fucking shit over here. Tower destroyed. Oh, yeah, well, I have a bunch now. Good. Air support engaging hostiles. I 
I think I was right about that area over there. Like, they're not getting by that at the moment. This is problematic, though, here. Let's go check this out and see how this is going. I mean, I do need more things. That is fucking them up better, though, over there. Airfields are getting shot down. Not too bad, not too bad so far. Um, it's always this side that gets me, so I'm putting something else over here. here. I don't want them destroying my towers and shit either. Get him! God. I think this is going better on this side because of that setup I have. Let's put in a couple. Can I put in any more? We need it now. Air support engaged hostile. All right, let me get rid of all these. about this other side now. Yeah. Fuck. Put this shit down. get through. Four units in the 
Oh my god. Our forces have been defeated. I say again, our forces have been defeated. We are pulling back from this region. Thank God. Excellent work. Humans are retreating and the core is secure. We are beginning to amplify geodetic waves to modify the planet's metallic core rotation. Good. A few additional modify the core's locations and rotation. We will be able to siphon matter and energy straight from its molten core. Prepare to transfer your consciousness to the next area. Oh my god. All right, we're going to get the energy from the core from the metal core of the earth. Thank you, Genetic Jackhammer BQ for the tier one sub. Oh my god. So really, so the way I was able to finally get through that is, I mean, I fucked it up earlier because I didn't get like the bonus thing because that one thing got destroyed. But um, basically, there was one area that was close enough where the enemies passed by it on both sides, so I was able to utilize the turrets on two sides, which saved me the money to be able to have enough turrets to get through it, if that makes sense. So you have to basically get them from two ways. Oh my god. Well, it's, this is great. I, this, I think this is, this is a great game. So, I mean, I have all these other ones that I have to go through. But um, I, I think that's enough for now. I think you guys get the idea. Um, if you want to be a space alien and take over the world, uh, this is the game for you. I think this is, that this is great. I don't really have any complaints that I can think of. Um, there's, a, there's a couple little things like I... But like for example like the base itself like I wish I knew how much health it had at all times uh, but maybe there's like a way to turn that on or something so I mean like I don't yeah I don't really have much to complain about here um, I don't know if I'm like if they want me to like go back to the earlier missions and like redo them better if it's kind of like that I'm assuming so but every one of these kind of has like a check mark on it like a gold, gold check mark a lot of times in these games it'll be like you know like a, a star rating or something and I don't see that here so I don't know if they want me to go back or what but uh, Ninfan I am thank you very much for the tier 1 sub the base health is on the lower right part of the screen isn't it is it um oh is that what that is on the lower right i mean i don't i actually honestly i've never looking at the lower right thing let's see um oh usa is next huh shit oh i haven't oh, oh fuck i haven't upgraded um oh protects the core. It shoots a powerful energy beam from the core's center at enemies that come close to it. I mean, that's awesome. <laughs> uh, this faster spaceship repair, I'm usually pretty good with that. I don't, I'll, that'd be nice eventually. Um, It's like an electric thing that shoots out from it. I mean, that's not bad either. Um, I think I want the core weapon, maybe? I mean, the problem, the real problem is when the core dies, right? Because it ends the whole game. So let's have that. I'm going to get that. Um, what is this? Oh, the debris thing. And then there's this. Oh, it's like an additional one. Okay, well, I'll, I'll eventually get all that. Um, so like, oh. They want they want they want me doing laser beams here. Okay, so I'm gonna take these off and I'll put that on. They want me doing that right now. And then uh, oh, here's the one little thing I think I think they should tell you that they I think the exclamation point should also be on that. That's one little minor complaint I have. 
So if, if, if it's a mission where they're like, oh, this is laser beams, I think they should put the exclamation point on all of the laser beam things. Like, now I get it. Because before, they, they had it on this, right? Like, so basically, if I do that, this, they're not going to be happy with that. Even though the exclamation point's on that. It's like, if that's telling you that you, like, you need to turn that on, and that's fine, but you also need to hit that one. And they should tell you that, I think. So there, there, there's a minor complaint, I guess. Uh, there's not much that I would complain about. Three technologies left. Uh, I guess I'm... They want this to be like a laser beam mission, I think. So it's like, I could take some of this shit off. And like, what is this one? This is like the missiles. And this is the plasma. I don't want to take any of the... Oh, yeah, the bombs, actually. You know, I don't, I'm not, like, using the bombs all that much because you have to switch to them. So, yeah, I'll just take those off, and I'll put it on that. I'll put it on the laser beam. It's probably better for me. Um, and then the two that I have left, I could put it into the other flame. Oh, no, I have to have some kind of air defense. Hold up. That won't be good. Wait, I need that. You, I have to have air defense. Actually, honestly, like I want one of those to hang on. I gotta, I gotta rethink this. Um, what is this one? This is the bomb. I'm gonna take that off. I don't really need to use them. Um, and oh, like, that's pretty good. I want that. Um, shit. I want to be able to put one more thing on. I want to have the flamethrower. I don't use that very often, like the upgraded one. I guess I could take that off in exchange for either one of these. They want this to be like laser. I'll put the laser one on for this one. And now, can I use this on anything? I mean, I guess I can. Put it on that for now. All right, I'm gonna. That's what I'm gonna do for my upgrades. And then, um, so this is USA now. So I wanted to just see. The, so the lower right, I guess they're saying is the how much the base health it is. Is that what that lower right is? I never knew what it was. <laughs> they are often coordinating attacks against our cores and actively supporting other human tribes. Our simulations concluded that in order to minimize the cost of defending our cores, yeah, how dare those Am Americans this try to defend actions into chaos and make <laughs> our tasks easier in other parts of the planet. Just as we expected, the well, we'll, we'll take them out in the USA. Oh! After the defeat near the Caspian Sea, the Russians tried to destroy the Exmorph base with a nuclear this is, strike. So we're in New Jersey. I like how it. This is a. This is this is what this is America. <laughs> this is what they think. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's just, it looks like a fucking factory, like, okay, that's great, this is hilarious, oh my god, they should have like, they should have like smoke coming out of everything and just like, <laughs> Industrial forces. <laughs> right. We've got a clear approach to the X-Morph. I mean, I guess it's supposed to be like the future or whatever. In regular ground forces. All right, so let's see. What are we going to do here? Okay, so the bottom right, is that 25% for the base? So that's showing how much base health? Is that what that fucking means? And then the bottom right icon is like that's your harvester thing harvester slash base whatever we call it i guess that's what that is so it does tell you the whole time I th if that's what that is i want to like lose 25 percent of the base health just so that i can know for sure if that's what that is but anyway um so shit i guess i'm gonna do this one too um 
I'm like addicted to this. This is a problem. So yeah, so this would go up this way. All right, I'm gonna block this off, number one. Number one. This, I was gonna stop, but now I'm like, eh, now I gotta, now I gotta do this though. Now I gotta be in New Jersey though. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> Oh my god. All right, so like here to here. I think that's good. There we go. Hey. There we go. Now that's going around to there. Now can I get... Okay, I can't combine those. At least that was something, though. And then this one... Oh, wow, look at all this. So this, I want to like combine with that. So I need to have like, okay, so let's do like here, oops, to there, to like there and put in the fence. Good, that changes that direction, so that's good. So they're all going around here, they're coming around here, and there's that. This bridge will probably get like blown up. Um, huh. So now they're all kind of converging over here, basically. So basically you have this and you have this, but there's no way to get these to come together. That's all right. You know what, I don't want these to get blown up. You know what, I need like, I need some protection over here though, so many things that have to happen. You know what's nice about this is this is all surrounded by water, so that means none of that is gonna come after the base, so that's pretty nice. That is pretty nice. And they might come up from here later, I don't know. No, they'll come up and then they'll go around, I think, and then they'll have to go all the way around like that. Okay, so that's good. So we need, I need some shit over here. Let's have that. I'm gonna put in an, I should have an anti-air. Well, I'll put one in when I can, I guess. Oh shit, and then there's this over here, fuck. Hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take one of these out. This is kind of bad news here. I mean, I could put one here, I guess. No, but then they're gonna, oh well, the idea is that hopefully they don't come over there. All right, I will put it there, here. Actually, if it was a flamethrower, I don't have the money for that though. This is like, this is messy for a start. Mm. All right, I'm gonna start it. So let's see. Here we go, here we go. Protect the Wendy's. Yo, that'd be great if there was like places like that. There's like a Target and like a... Fucking, there's like a Starbucks and shit. Yeah, where's the drive through Dunkin' Donuts? <laughs> or whatever. Look how fucked up everything's getting. What a bad start. That's all right, we're gonna get to see about the base. Oh yeah, I can even see it going down already. Oh my God. Come on, bring me back. Here. God damn it. At least when the core explodes, it killed everybody. So now I know for sure about the core on the bottom right. That's fine. All right, I didn't even, I never even knew. Now I know. The aliens have already built strong fortifications. I'm sending in tanks with strong infantry support. All right, now I should be all right. Now I'm gonna put in all this. I need, okay, so I, hold up. 
I have to have some air defense, first of all, because this is just bad news. All right, that's at least an air defense thing. So then, also, it's like, they, it seems like they want me to like do these like lasers and shit. Ooh, fuck, look at that. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Maybe I can make, can I make another one of those? Fuck it, let's do another one. All right. All right, let's try this shit. What are you gonna do? Come on, come on. I got my laser beams. Yeah, I would definitely like to know about if there's anything that can, like, repair the base. That definitely would be nice. Are these laser beams gonna do anything? I thought I thought these laser beams are supposed to be like Seems like they're not doing shit. Doing shit, if you ask me. Oh, dude, I'm like dead already. Dude, fuck these laser beams. Dude, I'm just dead. I think I have to go back to the previous levels and like level up, honestly. I'm like getting too far ahead of myself here. That's what I think. I mean, it's like level two and I'm already 50%. Like, I'm fucked. Regular tanks are too weak to break through. I'm sending in advanced tanks with plasma shields. Yeah, no. Here. I'll just die. Like, that's what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna die. So, here. All right, at least I know about the fucking See, now I feel stupid, because I didn't know. And then look at all this shit, too. Then there's survival. Then there's... Then there's this. There's all these other fucking things, too. Holy shit. <laughs> this is very worth getting. This is very worth getting. This is good. Um, holy fuck. So... <sighs> All right, that's a USA. It's like now I'm getting down to where it's like more difficult now. But I have all these upgrades now, so it's like if I went to back to Canada, let's say, I could probably fucking do Canada like way better. You know. Starting a different mission than the one you're currently playing will erase the progress of the current mission. Yeah, I, that's fine. And on this mission, they want you to have... Here, now I can take the laser beam shit off. They want they want you to have this shit on here, apparently. And then I could, like, fucking have that or some shit. So this is an earlier mission. I'm going back to, I'm going back to Canada because I'm, I'm assuming it'll be, like, easier. And see if, like, if I were to, like, do this again. The aliens have landed in the outskirts of the city. I don't know if I Main get... forces aren't ready yet. We're sending in a small reconnaissance force. See, this has to connect to this. You want to, like, block this shit off. So we're going to do, like, that. 
and we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna connect them, and get that shit like that, yeah. And then we're like this. Then I want like an air defense. Air defense would be nice right by my base. I don't, so like I wonder if I beat Canada and I don't even fucking take like any damage on my base now, cause I'm like a little stronger than I was when I did it the first time. I'm like, will I be like in good shape or? So let's put in that. And let's put in that. Now let's start this. We'll see how it goes. Like, I don't fucking know. All right, start. Why did it not start? Start, start, start. Hello, computer. The game break or like what? Oh, did I not hit this? I guess I didn't even hit the damn start button. <laughs> That's my fault. I didn't hit the start. I've been playing this too long. I need to stop. Thank you, uh, Vermin, for the sub. You know why the level didn't start? I didn't hit the start button. I've been playing this for seven hours. This is, I'm gonna end soon. I'm just gonna play this and then we're gonna be done. Mike's PC is overheating at like, at this point, who knows? This is definitely a recommend. I think this is a, this is a game you should get. In my opinion. Like this is some good shit. I think at least. Why didn't it, nobody told me about this until this week? I didn't even know this fucking game existed. This game has been around since 2017. 2017 is 2022. Nobody fucking told me that this exists. What, what other games are out there that you guys are not telling me about? I know why this. Do you want me to play like Pest Terminator and shit? Is why you don't. They're like, we're not gonna tell Mike about the good games. We want him to play like the Wizard of Oz. We don't want him to play the good shit. We want. That's why. Thanks, fuckers. Apparently you had this on Steam for three years. Have you played it, Bread Green Blue? Because I have a lot of games on Steam that I buy and that I don't, I don't even play them. Fuck. There we go. Oh shit, we're not done. have already fortified their positions. They are beginning to transform the terrain near their base. It's the same invasion pattern we observed in Africa. We have to keep the aliens from expanding their influence. You want me to play the Game Boy Mega Man games? I w I'll eventually go through all of them. I mean, like, I, when I do that, like, I'll probably do, like, one of them. You know, like maybe I would do like Mega Man 3 or something like that, the Game Boy one. And then at some point like later I'll do another one. Like eventually like I'll do them all, but probably not like back to back. Shantae on Game Boy Color. Uh, I, like I'll have to fuck with it a bit and see if like I'm into it. Um, and then beat Rygar on stream. I mean, I could do that. I've beaten Rygar before on my own. I think I've beaten that game like twice, two or three times in my life. Um, I've done it before. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, that's true. I haven't done it on stream, I guess, have I? I did it in the Let's Play video. Yeah, may, I could do that, possibly. Those are all possibilities. Like, eventually. Maybe, at some point. Possible. The Mega Man ones are the most likely. Because I definitely, you know, you know me, I like my Mega Man stuff. All right, so all these guys are going to come down here. Let's get something in there to fuck them up. Let's have that, and they're going to come here. Yo, you know what? No, 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 no. The problem is 
I want here. I want this to be like this. Yeah, that's better. And they'll still be getting hit, and then I'm out of money already. <laughs> but that's alright, at least they're all coming on one path here. I haven't lost any base health yet. Oh, you know what about the base health? I wonder if how do I how do I say this? So you see how there's four blocks for the base health? It's like 25, 25, 25, 25 makes 100. I wonder if let's say the first block of 25, like 75 to 100. Let's say that that got down to 80 percent, but then it goes to the next wave. I wonder if it repairs itself back to 100 percent, and that's how your base gets repaired. That might be how this works as far as being repaired. M maybe. Anyway, let's do the. Let's do this. Life mobile squad reporting. Advancing to target rapidly. Rygar can be beat in 10 minutes. I'm sure it can be. Um. You know, there's people that have beat, like, Ocarina of Time using glitches in, like, five minutes and stuff. But, like, I don't know. Does it matter? Is that what it's all about for you? Is that how you enjoy games? By how fast you can get it over with? <laughs> how fast can I possibly get this game over with and move on with my life? <laughs> right? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know, I'll just play this shit for hours and hours and hours. I don't care how long it takes. That, that has no... I'm not, I don't know, that's why, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not a speedrun person. I've, told, I've discussed that a million times. Like, I, I think it's super impressive, and I like watching other people do that. But, like, this, having a time limit stresses me out. It gives me anxiety. Even watching other people do that gives me anxiety. It's like, oh, my God, are they going to make it? Are they going to make it on time? I definitely like to be able to take my time as much as possible in games. I, I like to go through the games very slowly, actually. Very slowly and over and over. <laughs> and, and like stop, go, like get something to drink, get something to eat, take a break for a while, come back to it another day. Like very leisurely is how I like to do it. The complete opposite. Oh shit, that got blocked off. Wait, wait, take that out. Fuck. I didn't mean to block that off like that. Um. Significant reinforcements have just arrived. I'm opening a new attack front on the western side of the city. I also received confirmation that new super heavy tank prototypes are already on their way and should be joining the battle soon. The battle zone has been expanded. Oh god, now they're expanding the battle zone. Make my life difficult. Let's see if there's any way to get them over. Probably not. There's probably no way to get it to combine, right? So let's see. Let go over here, go over here. Can't get them to go over there. Nope, no way to combine it. Okay. So... What if I brought them around this side? Does that help me? It's like not really much more than anything else. I mean, if I block off that to that. Oh, I should do that. That gives me, that buys me a little bit of time. Okay, so here, we're gonna do that to that. Can that connect? Okay. That's why they put in this, so you can move it a little bit. There. And then there. 
Oh god, it's putting it there. <sighs> Don't do that. All right, here. And then... Oh, alright, you have to do that for it to, okay. There we go. So they're in there, and then they're gonna go down here, and then they gotta go around. There we go. Okay, then let's have them be getting hit the whole time as this is going on. Okay, that's taking care of that. I didn't really put shit over here, but there already is some stuff. So, eh, I wish I could put more stuff down, but all right, let's do this. How many waves? Is it six waves? Three or six? All right. This is the last one I'm doing. So I went back to an earlier one just to see if, I, I want to just see if I, I'm hoping that I can get through this one now without uh, losing any base health, but we'll see. We shall see. We need support. Ops Team Romeo, Tango, Zulu, prepare for the next wave. You're cleared to engage. Yes, sir. Air support, your location, one minute. Thank Brigade reporting. We need a stop. Hoping I can put down another thing there. Shit. Fuck out of here. Oh god, what's going on on this side? up here. Right, I'm going to put another one down here. Anti-air missiles. Boom. Air support engaging lost arms. Are you? Come and get me. Where are they? Come here. Come here, you fucks. Oh, they're running away. They're turning they're turning around. They fucking ran away. Pussy bitch. <laughs> Did you see him fucking spin around? A strong tank assault force is rolling in from all directions. We'll give them hell. Alright, so around from here. Oh. Oh yeah. So, fuck you. Well, here's what we do then. That goes there. That goes there. Can I put it, can I make it a flamethrower? And then, there. Good. Fuck them. Let's go. Let's see how this goes. Super heavy bulldogs. Fast forward.
directions. Engage the enemy as well. I should put something else over here. I can actually put another one down too. They're not even getting like close to my shit this time. I'm getting better. Either that or I just have more powerful shit. It's probably a combination of both. I love this charge up and then you just fucking take out like a hundred. It's really satisfying. Like really, really satisfying to do this. <laughs> I guess that's why I'm playing it for so long. Very, like, the combat is very, like, fun. Here, let's put in another one. Do, 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 do. I like charging this up all the way. There you go. Boom, 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 boom. Boom! Oh, that was the full charge. Here, I want, I want to do that again. I'm not even gonna have that opportunity because they're gonna blow them up first. There. All right, that was wave four or six. I'm gonna make it. Like, what else are you gonna do? They're gonna, they're coming from the cell. Can you please push the jelly? Make everything that's near their structures. The ground and trees are being overgrown. You wonder why it's so satisfying? We have to stop them. Luckily, they haven't fortified. Probably because like. The people who made this were probably like, all right, like, what works and what doesn't work? Is this fun? Is this satisfying? Like, it was like they played it and then they were like, this, you know, they were making a game that they wanted to be, like, work and be fun. And, like, you know, it's like some of these games that I play sometimes, I'm like, did they even play it? Did they even fucking play it? Or they, or I feel like sometimes what happens, they get to the point where they, they get, like, 60% of the way, and then they're like, ah, good enough, and then they, like, give up. You know, doesn't it seem that way sometimes? I mean, some of the shit that I play, <laughs> but, you know, I play, some of the crap that I play is fucked. You know, let's try that. Block that off, and they're coming this way. Can I make that go? No, I can't make that go into there, so. So what we got here is gonna be like, boom. Boom, that's about, probably about the best I can do at the moment, I guess. South of the alien base. Be advised, southern attack routes are now open. I repeat, attack from the south. They thought it would be satisfying that the player can build up and shoot his wad. Like Doom. The old wad joke. Ah, uh, it's a classic. Air support ready. We've got your back. Over. The old wad. Do they know they're not going to get through? Do they know that? Do they realize that I'm not going to allow it? Maybe they don't. Do, 
to do. Although they're not giving me much extra things here. Now we're gonna put one here. One ship's attacking the alien. Oh, it just used that extra laser thing I have. <laughs> what are they gonna do? They don't even know what to do. Humans! You do not know! To defeat me, you filthy human! They're fucked. Like, what are you gonna do? What is this, Canada? This is Canada, I think, by the way. The Last of Us is becoming a series on HBO Max in January 2023. Cool, what's that? Is that that game that has uh, the guy from Walking Dead? Or whatever, it's like his face the whole time. Decimating our regular army unit. But this time we've got a new group of bulldog tanks. They'll or is that one of those other ones? We're attacking from all directions at once, so the aliens won't be able to concentrate their fire. We don't have any additional forces in this region. This is the deciding battle. Oh, Death Stranding. Oh, okay. So it's a different thing? I don't know. I don't know about all that. Yo, if you want to talk about Fester's quest, uh, I'm your guy. <laughs> like, you guys know about Fester's quest? I'll tell you all about Fester's quest. You like the, the gun that goes into the wall? I don't know. I don't know about all those games. All those games where people are talking, or like, don't do it. Don't talk. Just don't talk at all. Be quiet. It's not a movie. Th this is, this has some talking, though. This I'm alright with. Because, I, like I've said like a bunch of times in the stream, this is like, hey, you need to build, you need to put a fence here to here, is what the guy says to you. And I'm like, oh, okay. That, that has to do with what I'm doing in the game. They're not like, oh my god, telling me some, what some fucking asshole is doing. Like, like a hundred years ago, there's this fucking person that you're gonna meet later in the game. It's like, cool, that's great, thanks, shut up. Heavy tanks riding for battle, engaging alien targets. All right, here we go. Talking is good when it complements the gameplay, not it's not good when it gets in the way of it. Yeah, exactly. It's a good way to put it. It's a good way to put it. I agree. You're, you are more eloquent than I. All right, these fuckers. I'm gonna put something like right there. I wonder if I could just not do anything and I, if I would make it, because I'm strong enough. Probably not that strong. I'm charging this all the way, all the way, all the way. Heavy column destroyed. We're losing this. Oh. Our 
Shit, come on. Get him. Those guys on the other side, like, aren't gonna do shit. I really didn't get this guy yet. Here, have another. Have another. Oh, this is the last wave? Yeah, I'm, like, way stronger now, huh? How do you like this? How do you like it? How, how does this feel for you? How about some of this? How do you like that? Access that was Canada. Okay. So, do I get anything? I didn't get hurt. I did. That's like I did great. So like. Oh, debris collected is poor. I need those debris upgrades. So the time, time is perfect, they're saying. Core damage is almost nothing, so they're saying that's great. Regenerations is perfect. Is that like if, you, is that if you die, one of your things die, and then nothing dies, so that was perfect. And then I didn't really collect debris. So uh, that, I'm not good at. <laughs> I have to le learn about the debris collection still. But okay. So I mean, that was like way better. So the question then is, did I get anything out of that? Well, it says plus one upgrade. So I think I did then. I did get something. So I want to put that upgrade on. So hey, wait. So then that was worth doing, huh? Well, that's... Thank God. <laughs> um, so, also, there's the debris thing. I should probably get it, right? This is an active upgrade. Ple press RT while your spaceship is in ghost mode to use it. Oh, okay, that's how they do it. It creates an energy vortex that sucks in debris from the destroyed enemies. Gathering debris adds resources which can be used to build defense towers. So basically when I'm in the middle of a battle, I have to be in ghost mode. So basically when I'm building shit in battle if I also hit RT then it'll suck in the debris. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> like the chances of me doing that or glow. Like, maybe I'd do it here and there a little bit. I don't know about that. I think I don't want that. What about this? Passive. It protects the X-Morph X -morph ship automatically. Automatically. I like that. That I'm probably going to get. What, what else? Automated de offensive drone, which circles the ship. Like, that's good. I should have that and that. The automated stuff's great because I don't have to remember anything because I have the memory of a goldfish. And then this is improves the repair. Well, that's good too. I think I want both of these things. I think I want that drone. I'm going to take the... Oh, fuck. I thought I had an upgrade. Why does it say zero upgrades left? I thought I had a fucking upgrade. Why is it telling me I had no upgrade? What? Didn't it say on the screen a minute ago? Right there. Plus two technologies. Plus one upgrade. I thought that's what I just got. Oh, wait. I'm stupid. No, what that means, that's what you get if you beat it. I thought they were saying that's what I... Got, I thought that's what I had and that's what I could apply. Never mind. That's what you get. That's the reward. That's where they tell you that. All right. Never mind. I read that wrong. 
So, yeah, so by doing Canada again, does that mean that I didn't get anything extra? So, is this a game where you don't replay the missions at all? I mean, that's actually kind of cool if you don't. You do you beat it once and then you move on, I guess. I don't really know. Anyway, I'm going to stop. I've been streaming this game a long time. This is my first time ever playing this game. I like it a lot. Obviously, I don't understand everything about it, but um, if you are an X-Morph defense expert, uh, leave me a comment on YouTube. Let me know what I'm not understanding because there's probably quite a bit. And then another thing I want to know, if I play this game again later, um, so then there's all this shit. Like, what's up with all this? Is like like European assault? Is that like a whole nother game? Like the story mode? Like what about this last bastion? And then this shit? It's just I wonder if survival just goes on like forever. Like it's like how long can you survive for? If that's what that is, that's fucking awesome. Um, I have a feeling it's, that must survival. That has to be what that is, right? So survival is all that matters. Get your ass on the battlefield and get sucking. Get down there and get sucking. <laughs> Impressive snake. We're not playing that game right now. Metal Gear Solid VR Missions is the only 3D Metal Gear game Mike will ever play. Um... I've been told that on PlayStation 2, there is another Metal Gear game that's kind of like VR missions, where it's, just, where it's just like missions. I forget the name of it off the top of my head, but uh, one of the PS2 ones, I guess, is also like that, so maybe like that. Also, like I didn't even finish, I would want to finish the VR missions, so maybe someday I'll go back to that, I don't know if anybody's interested in seeing more of that, but that was a fun game. There, there's also other things I want to play on uh, PlayStation 1. I want to play, uh, uh, in, is it Intelligent Cube, I think it's called? I don't know if you guys have heard of that, that's like a cool game. Is this your game to defeat this December? I don't know, maybe. Um, I guess in November I beat what's it called? Uh, Returnal, which was, I, you know, looking back on it, like, I, I did like that game. Sometimes I like to, like, give myself some space in between. Like, you ever go see a movie and you're like, you see a movie in the theater and you're like, oh, that was pretty good. And then, like, a month goes by or two months goes by. I don't know. I don't know if you're like this, but that's how I am. I might, like, see a movie and be like, oh, yeah, I like that. And then you think about it, and you're like, wait a second, that movie sucked. <laughs> you know? I I have that, like, I do that sometimes. Or you watch a movie the second time, you see it, like, later on, you know, now it's on Netflix or something. You're like, oh, yeah, that movie. I saw that in the theater. I think I like that. And you're like, well, I don't want to watch it again, though. Oh, you know what? Actually, you know what? And the more I think about it, that movie is terrible. Hmm, I liked that movie, you know? I do that a lot. And so, like, you know, I don't know. <laughs> you realize the movie sucks after. But, like, as far as, like, you know, uh, games, sometimes I like to give space in between. I'm like, okay, I played through some game. Did I like it or not like it? And then I, like, feel differently about it, like, later. So, like, I still feel like I like that Returnal game. Like, I would actually still, even though I beat it, I would go back and play, like, uh, the, what's it called? I would go back and play the, uh, I'm trying to think of the name of it. Um, there's, like, a tower. It's, like, an endless tower. The endless tower thing's, like, pretty cool that they put that in there. It's, like, reason to keep playing it. But WarioWare on Switch... Yeah, no, I want um, I want to play Wario Land on Game Boy. So I might do Wario Land on Game Boy stream. Um, Intelligent Cube on PS One is that is good? Is that good? Well, we'll see. I I've only played a little bit of it, but from what I played so far, it seemed like a pretty cool game, and I, I want to play that. Maybe I'll do that and then like play that for a while and then. <sighs> play other PlayStation games. 
you know, maybe that'll be the main feature, and then we'll play some other PlayStation stuff. Like, there's a hundred billion games on PS1 I want to play. I haven't, I know that I've done so many, like, NES streams, and I, like, I, I'm usually, like, focused on that, but, like, I need to do more Game Boy stuff. I need to do more PS1 stuff. And I'm very well aware, so I'm, like, trying to, like, do more of that. I'd like to, like, li like beat some PS1 games, but I want some, I got I want some games that are, that you can do in one stream, like, like Metal Gear VR missions, I could probably beat it, but I'd probably have to do, like, two more streams on it. It's like, I need games, tell me some games, let me know later, in the, if you know any, in the YouTube comments or whatever, let me know some PS1 games that you could just do in, like, so this stream was, like, seven hours. I usually don't do streams this long, usually my stream, let's say, like, five hours. What's a PlayStation 1 game that's good that you could beat in five hours? Like, let me know. And then, and then it's like, it depends. You know, it's possible. There are games that's like, oh, it's possible to beat in five hours, but you might not necessarily, depending on how well you do. I mean, I know that, but play Goldeneye. I like Goldeneye. Goldeneye is a good game. Master System. Yo, oh, speaking of Master System, by the way, that's from Zenato Nineteen. I another that another game I want to play. I want to play uh, Golden Axe Warrior. Which is sort of like a Zelda clone. Is it a good game though? Has anybody here beaten Golden Axe Warrior? Is it worth playing through? You know, because that happens too sometimes. I'm like, oh, I'm gonna play Golden Axe Warrior, and then I put it on, and I'm like, then I'm like an hour into it, and then I'm like, eh. for you know, there'll be like one reason or another that the game's like kind of, eh. so I don't know. You don't know until you play it, right? I guess. Gabellius, right? Baldur's Gate. Yeah, that one, um, I played the GameCube version of that not long ago. There's like, there's one of those on GameCube. Yeah, Red Zero, yeah, I do remember that. I definitely do. Dead Space, Dead Space I liked. Definitely, that was good. I think I play. I think I played through that on like medium, like normal, and then I liked it so much I went through it again and did it on the hard, harder difficulty. So I went through that twice. I think I believe from what I remember, and I definitely liked that game. Also, now that there's been some space between when I streamed Dead Space and now, I can still say that I definitely enjoyed Dead Space. That was that's that was a good game. Um. Yeah, so, 007 Nightfire. Uh, so, I, when that game came out, I had it for GameCube back then, and I beat it back then, like, the single player, but I more so liked the multiplayer in that, and the um, especially that, the thing I loved about that game the most was the, uh, there's probably a specific name for it, but, like, the, the heat-seeking rocket launcher thing that you could shoot off, and then you can, like, Guy, the guided guided missile, I guess it was called in that. That was like the most like fun fucking thing. I like love that guided missile and multiplier. Um, I really like that. There's, I think there's like the snow level too with the two houses on either side. That's a really fun. That's a really fun game. But all right. Uh, yeah. Oh, the boss fight. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that's the stream. Hope you enjoyed. I recommend this game. I think it's really fun. Uh, so if you like Tower Defense, pick it up. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys next time with something else. Bye, guys. Have a good night.